Hey everybody, welcome back to Backseat Drawing, episode number four. I'm here with Enan. We're live on Twitch, and we're getting ready to do some art. How are you, Enan? <laughs> I am doing fantastically. I'm turning on the AC, so I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I was walking away a little bit. Yeah, I'm, but, uh, I'm honestly sweating as well. I think it's too hot out right now. Yeah, no, I get it. It's so hot. The heat, but uh, yeah, no, I'm doing good. Uh, yeah, here to draw with apostrophe. That'll be that'll be that'll be fun. Yeah, we're gonna draw. You're actually going to draw. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. It's I'm been getting a, it's you been getting you to do some work today. <laughs> yeah, goddamn, <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> when was the last? Oh wait, I feel like I asked you when the last time you were drawing on stream was. But you say that you draw on stream kind of often, right? I do. Last time I streamed was when I drew, so I'm gonna say, oh wait, no, it was the day before that, so 11th of this month, so like five days ago. Oh, oh. I'm really That's drawing it. like every day on stream. I wanna, I, wish, I wanna draw every day. I wish I could play some video games instead. <laughs> I mean, you can. Can I? I don't know. My homework is kind of crazy. Okay, now now we're getting into real life territory. Are you on. are you a student? Don't you don't you understand? <laughs> I do, I do. Are I you in do. school? I, I mean, I'm, I've been out. I gotta start going to college at some point soon, whenever I can muster up yeah. the energy to get admitted. I I've been running around this, skirting around this for a while. Yeah, running, avoiding college. I've had that yeah. a couple times in my life. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I mean, you don't have to do it. <laughs> I mean, I might not have to. Oh, God. Hold on. Figuring out how this canvas works. I know. It can be, it's oh, a little can, bit confusing can, oh. at first. Oh, okay. It's the same. Okay, good, good to know. Good to know. It's like trying to figure it out. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't too sure about college either for a while. And then once I got going... I started enjoying it. And now I hate it again, so I don't know. <laughs> you can come back to where you start eventually. Yeah, I think that, like, if you go to a small college, it's nice. But once you're at, like, a big yeah. college, I, I'm going insane over here. The problem is I'm going to be going outside the country to go to college. Oh, really? So, yeah, so on yeah. top of... Which country the are old, you planning? Probably Malaysia. Probably. I'm still not sure. My, I, there's a chance I might go Germany. It really. Germany I know, sounds big like difference. fun. That sounds it, like it, fun. It is fun, but also scary because of the fact that, you know, uh, just, the, just the not knowing anyone aspect of it. Yeah, it definitely scares does me. That. Yeah. You know, I realize I, I drew a cat. And, and you're way better at, and, at, at animals than me. Why did I do this? <laughs> we, don't, so we, don't talk, we don't talk about my skills at drawing animals. That's an that's a avoided I subject. I inferior now, goddamn. Hey, man, it's okay. I have some experience. <laughs> oh, God, hold on. I still don't know anyone in my school. <laughs> you don't? No, I mean, I have a couple of acquaintances and friends, but... It was hard at first. That first like semester hit me hard, I think. Like, uh, cause I transferred from a community college near my house in New Jersey to Georgia in the United States, which is like 16 hour drive away. Oh God. And I, yeah, it was like startling how different it is down here and how I just don't know anyone. Okay, that makes sense. Well, making friends by itself is a pain to begin with already so. yeah and also not having family around to like save my ass once things go wrong <laughs> yeah that's the that's the reason i don't want to go it's the reason i don't want to like I'm, I'm having a hard time you learn Just, a lot <laughs> you, yeah i imagine i imagine but it, it's terrifying to I'm, think about you know i think i might put twitch chat on the uh the overlay that way we can actually read chat. In previous okay. backseat drawing, I have not done chat interaction. But yeah. I always feel kind of bad, so I think I'm going to add them in. 
guys on oh there. Oh my god, Sagionon. Yeah. Yeah, no, a lot of people are here that I know me. Yeah, I'm like Mola gonna... knows me, two fools knows I'm gonna me. copy and paste my chat box in here. Because yeah, yeah. you guys deserve it. Warm reception here. Yeah. Well, everyone likes you, I think. Let's see where I can... That, I, 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 I hope not. God, I'm, I'm not a... I, don't know about all that. Let's not let's not get into everyone's opinion on Let's see me. if that works. Oh, chat box is oh. working. Okay, solid. Yeah. Okay. Good, good. Yeah, because you guys are chatting about college as well. Tufel says that he studies in a small university. Most students are from different cities, so it was easier to make friends because everyone was in the same situation when starting. Oh. Same school yeah. he already he originally looked at is a much larger and older technical university, much more people from the same city, meaning they're already friends. Right. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, that's the thing, right? I'm afraid because where I'm going, it's a new country in general. Not only do <laughs> I have true. the... <laughs> do you speak German? The, <laughs> nope, I don't. That's that's another thing that scares me as well about going to Germany, of all places. The, the thing about going to um, Malaysia would be people speak English there like often enough. So you can get a get away with just speaking English, but God, Germany, oh Lord, help me! Yeah, I, I definitely don't recommend coming to the U.S. either. By uh, the way, yeah, uh, if my family wants me to go to Canada, and I'm here like eh. Canada's pretty chill. <laughs> I don't I don't want to go to Canada. That's the thing. I don't oh. I don't want to go there. That's the thing. If you go to like Toronto, if you go like Toronto or something, sick. Canada's nice. Mm -hmm. And I imagine, I imagine, I, I'm assuming most countries are gonna be pretty nice, right? It's gonna be pretty, pretty much. And I'm not really all that bothered about, you know, being looked down on just because of where I come from. I don't really care. Why would okay. they look down on you? Wait, where are you actually hey. from? I feel Bangladesh. Like. Right. Yes, I remember yeah. this. So, the last time we voice chatted was like three years ago, probably. <laughs> yeah, it, it was, basically. I showed up, uh, well, you and someone else. I'm sorry, I'm blanking on the other person's name. It's probably Esther, my friend. Could could be, could be. I don't, as I said, I do not remember who it was at she's, this point. It's been a while. She's the one who always sits in voice chat with me, usually. Okay. But, um... Uh... Yeah, I, I'm from Bangladesh, and people normal, like generally look down upon my country's people anyways. So it's not something... I'm not all that bothered. I don't care. You right. Know? It doesn't really matter to me. You, my skill is all I really want to improve. I don't really care if people look down on me or whatever. I feel like the people that look down on you... I mean, I, it's kind of like... I feel like that doesn't happen too much. Yeah, it... it, it Nowadays, it's gotten much better. If I like, I mean, okay, well, the, the pandemic before, has made has made some people like really, uh, really angry. Worse, yeah. I think, but yeah, some people yeah, are yeah, nicer, yeah. I think, as well. Yeah, it it did something. <laughs> it, yeah, yeah, it yeah. did something. But if I mean the right people, and I don't think you'll experience like much of that if you meet the right homies in Canada. Dare I say? <laughs> yeah, no, no. I think Canada's gonna be fine. Uh, honestly speaking, with how much I hear how nice the people are there, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna have too much of a yeah, they're super of a nice. struggle. They do have some there. issues up there, but not as bad as the U.S. I think, as far as I know. Mm. There's racism that all over, <laughs> though. To be honest, <laughs> <laughs> that's true. The thing is, right here in Asia, if I go to Malaysia, for instance. <laughs> Asia's toxic as hell. I'm gonna be honest with you right now. <laughs> Asia's toxic as hell. I live here. The, the things I see sometimes make me question <laughs> what, what am I looking at, you know? So, you know, I'm ready. I'm ready. Are you ready to book I've it out of there? No, You're like. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. Mean, I'm ready to deal with it. I'm ready to deal with yeah. it. Sweden is. Racist as fuck, but people don't voice it openly. <laughs> yeah, that that's the thing, right? Most countries have this um, issue right racism. now. Quiet <laughs> racism. Yeah, quiet racism. Like, you don't get to ever hear it. It's mm. just like, but it's there. Yeah, definitely. You know, but it's there. I've definitely felt that uh, 
Definitely in the U.S. <laughs> like, and that's fine though, I don't really... What are you gonna do at the end of the day? You know, at, at worst you're gonna speak some shit, you know, you're gonna talk some shit, whatever. You know? Uh, for me it doesn't really bother me that much. I know like a lot of people get really bothered by it, but I, it doesn't really affect me that much. I've heard many things said about me in my life, so it doesn't get to me that much, right? So. I'm not really worried about that aspect. I'm more worried about the whole living alone aspect, right? Like, if I get sick, what what do? Yeah, you yeah, know, I, I feel that. Especially in a different country, what do you do? Yeah, what, what do I do? <laughs> I can't just call up my dad and be like, hey, uh, yeah, about uh, that, I, I'm really sick. I, I need your help. What do you do? Well, Canada's got that health insurance thing going for it. So I think if true, you're there true, on, like, true. a student visa or something, you're probably, like, set with health insurance <laughs> or so i would think i don't Maybe. know I, my parents I know. my parents keep telling me they're like if you get sick we can't help you like they don't know what i should do they're like you can go to the er but also the bill that we will get from that is insane i'm like okay <laughs> <laughs> I, I hear expensive. all the time about, like, how bad oh the uh, American, like, just the money issue is with, the, with going to a doctor. Apparently, it's like, crazy. costs one time, way too much. I sprained my ankle one time, like, and I was completely immobile on the ground uh, mm. a couple miles, a few miles from my house. And I had my dad's car with me. And I called my dad and I was like, bro, I'm like sprain my ankle and I'm totally knocked out and I'm gonna faint because I always faint and he was like should I call you okay. an ambulance and I was like no just walk <laughs> just walk here and then when you get here then we'll go to the ER oh, God. <laughs> so he like he that like never be a thing. <laughs> he like jogged over <laughs> oh my god that legitimately that shouldn't be a thing though honestly it shouldn't, speaking. It shouldn't. I should be able to call an ambulance and not have to front a $3,000 bill yeah what? Yeah, it gets, it gets pricey. Europe is damn good at this public, public health healthcare thing. He says I'm stumbling. Yo, I saw my yeah. streamer side comes out all Tuf the time. Tufels was telling me about how, like his knee, he ended up with a profit from staying in the hospital because of his knee injury. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. Europe is wild. Sweden is, Europe is wild. wild. <laughs> yeah, Sweden itself is is actually wild. Though. That country oh. is. I mean, I don't know. You guys have some benefits, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> some benefits. <laughs> uh, but no, definitely. Um, I'm thinking about where to go. Uh, that's definitely one of the things I'm thinking about. Well, but the main. Thing Before I, you yeah. go, you could like check who, who, what Twitch streamers are from there, and like sneak on their stream and try to befriend them before you get there, and then <laughs> you'll have friends when you get there. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. If, I don't know if, if I'm gonna be doing that. <laughs> I, honestly, though, I I like the 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 journey aspect to this. Like you know, the whole um, how do I put it? The the fact that it is. Um, very much a mystery what what I'm gonna what, what I'm gonna get right going yes. there wherever I'm going and even if it might not turn out all that well you know I, I like that aspect to this it's just terrifying yeah it's fun it's scary though traveling especially traveling that far alone yeah that very... that's that's why I'm thinking of staying in Asia and that's why like my first choice was Malaysia yeah I'm stressed I'm out being... I'm stressed out enough being like in the same country. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, I, I, like, I have some family, some quotes on that, like, distant family members in um, Malaysia, so that's, like, a plus, kind of, but I'm not gonna be talking to them because I don't... If I'm going to go somewhere... How do I make a new layer? Hold on. Oh, uh, did other. you delete your other one? No, 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 I didn't delete it. You I didn't hit delete. it. I hit it. No. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> this app. Yeah, you can lower the opacity and stuff too. I, I see it. I see it. 
It's very, very yeah. versatile program for being something in the browser for free, I gotta say. <laughs> it is actually, though, honestly. There we go, I found something that has opacity control. <laughs> uh, finally, something I can sketch with. Can I? What are you planning on going to college for? Art. Art. I'm not. I was hoping know, I, that you would not say art. <laughs> I, I was hoping to, you know, the, the original <laughs> plan was not going there for art, but then. But you know what? I was like, Don't let your dreams be dreams. You yeah, know? I, was like, I get you it. <laughs> I was like, you know what? Screw it. Whatever. Let's go. Let's do this. I have definitely understand that. I thought several times I was like, I can't go to school for art. That shit sucks. And here I am sitting in art school. So I don't know. Yeah, no, I, 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 I thought the same way for a, for a while. I don't know why I'm drawing sh shit so small. It's the problem with being like an artist. I draw something very small, then I enlarge it, and then I paint over it. Yeah, I scale, scale my drawings like a billion times. Yeah, and I can't do that in this app though, so I'm not gonna. I thought or, several. Well, I can't do it effectively. I thought several times about doing engineering instead. Yeah, same. Uh, not engineering, but like programming is what I thought. Oh, I was man, like, yeah. maybe I should go down that that road. But uh, you could look at game like, development no. as well. I thought about that too. Yeah. But uh, I was like, you know what? Screw it. I'll I'll just do art. Yeah. I really wanna. You game development at my school, and a lot of it is art, concept art, and such. Mm. And animation. Makes sense. The issue with Asia is school sponsors. Yeah. Yeah. They they want so much out of you too. Oh my god. Oh my god, please. I beg it. Stop wanting. Stop taking. <laughs> <laughs> they don't give you a rest period. They're just like, you know what, do this, do that. Yeah. They don't care. Yeah, I have Fridays off here. It's pretty hype. <laughs> I don't know, I like uh like my school scad. I don't know if I'm allowed to shit talk them or not, but I'm gonna anyway. This is going on, this is going on YouTube. I'm sorry, Paula. Uh, the, the owner of SCAD. They're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna, I'm sorry, Paula. They're gonna write a very mean email about you. SCAD has, in the, in the past, had some issues with students' mental health mm. being really bad. Maybe a couple suicide attempts here and there from the student body. And then, oh. and then they gave us Fridays off. And <laughs> <laughs> Rather than like working on the work like, ethic in the classroom, they're like, "No, you guys get another day off now." That's a yikes! That's a that's a yikes right there. Goddamn! How? What? Yeah. You can't just. You can't just do that. Yeah, it's a little kooky here, but it's okay. So be okay, careful. Well, I be just. I haven't drawn in five days, and I'm really feeling it right now. You're feeling like bad, or you're feeling like, yeah, like my oh my not... gosh, I feel like it's all coming back to me. No, I'm feeling, I'm feeling like it's not, it's not, it's not coming back. I it's think left. So this is, yeah, see, that's one of the pros of drawing all day every day for me is that I never, uh, I'm never off. Although these little cat arms are kind of sus, but <laughs> I mean, it looks very cute, so it's fine. Mine just looks weird. Tufel said, I? living in a different country, what the F do you do when you literally cannot stand up? Yeah, that's sus. Because of his knee. He oh. Got, Tufel's oh. got like... Did you hear about yeah. Tufel's and his I, knee? I heard it. I heard oh it. Oh my yeah, god. Uh, this, this that was wild. such a... I, he would like come onto my stream every day and then like tell me about his issues and it just kept getting worse and worse. Yeah, and it, it like, kept getting worse for a while. And I was like, I don't know what to tell you, but <laughs> I hope you, I wish you the <laughs> best of luck. <laughs> Stay strong. And then one day he shows up to stream and he's like, hey, I'm in the ER. And I'm like, I'm watching your stream. I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> uh, so, God. Sounds like two fools, though. Yeah, it sounds does. like two fools. In, I, a, in, a, in, a, in a situation that's like, hey, yo. Maybe I should focus on, on my own. No, 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 no. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I respect yeah. it. My stream might bring him some happiness in the ER. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but if, did it if, if you're in a different Putting country, if you're in a different country from your family and stuff, what do you even do in a situation like that? I don't know. Well, that's the thing that scares me, right? Yeah. 
Just don't get sick. I gotta... <laughs> yeah, that's that's the idea. Or, in, to... or injured. Don't go outside and you'll be fine. That's the idea, right? Just, uh... Get your COVID just vaccine to... and... <laughs> <laughs> just survive. Oh my just try your best to live it out. Yeah, that's seriously scary. Oof. Like my... I like how I always go for one face. And it's, it's always It's angry. always angry, yeah. My neighbor <laughs> my neighbor came to my room on stream the other day. And he was, like, bleeding yeah. everywhere. Because he, he, like, flew off of his skateboard and got injured. Oh, oh my He was gosh. like, I can't go to the ER. I don't have any money. And I'm like, oh my god. So I had to, like, <laughs> cut, clean all of his wounds and stuff for him. <laughs> it was so bad. <laughs> what? What? Yeah, and... Uh, That's wild. We don't have, like, a nurse on campus or anything. There's no, like, school nurse. What? Which is very strange. And, uh, the resident people, like, the people that are in charge of the building aren't allowed to, like, give us band-aids or anything, so... It's They're very... not allowed to? Yeah, I, I did not understand. I didn't know that was a thing either until that night. That was super weird. Yeah. It's that, a good okay, thing. That, that makes no sense. Good thing I had a first aid everything kit. Else, <laughs> every, everything else I get, all right, I understand, sure. Money, whatever, I, I get it. it. It's stupid, I get it, though. But <laughs> you're not allowed to give them the basic, the basic necessity. Yeah, band-aids. The best thing was oh. that, like, that, the, the prior Halloween, I cosplayed as, like, Sasuke from Naruto. And I had all those bandages no. for like ah. the, the ankles and the and the arms yeah. and whatnot. Like he wears those I bandages, so I had bandages. <laughs> I had bandage wrappings for him because of that. <laughs> thank God. <laughs> Only very lucky. reason. Yeah, thank you, Sasuke. We're not Sasuke. <laughs> Sasuke saved. Was it saved? <laughs> Sasuke saved. I ended up looking much life. more like a generic Naruto character than anyone specific, but it worked out. In the end, saved his ass. I mean, okay, listen, Sasuke saved a life. <laughs> <laughs> Sasuke saved a life. That, that's all I, that's all that I, that, I can't even go on with this joke, oh my god. Dude, this cat is getting way too detailed. I think I gotta, I think I gotta bail. That's an adorable gotta, gotta, kitten, thank you. It, it is, it I is am very so cute. I need to, I'm so dehydrated today. Oh my god. You know, you know what would fix that? Water. I'm drinking water right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that is, that is a lot of sass coming out of my brain. Oh, hold on. We figured that we dialed that back. Oh my gosh, it's the drawing. It's like in, invoking the sass in you. Uh, yes, it's the yes. art. The art it, <laughs> often imitates. <laughs> life oft, often imitates art. <laughs> yes, that is the reality. It's not the opposite way around. Don't, don't, don't art, look it up. Art imitates life. Don't. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Art is art is strange. It is definitely. That's why this drawing looks so strange. Mine, I mean. Yeah. Well, my favorite times yeah. in art school and in college for art in general have been sitting in like modern art history classes and the professors r rambling for hours about how art is so deep and like this <laughs> splatter painting invokes feelings of whatever and whatever and i'm just sitting there like i just draw cartoons and i don't like know what to say about this <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna be me too yeah that will uh, probably be, be you soon. you'll feel it you'll I'm be just, like hmm <laughs> i'll just be sitting there like oh this is what a postural meant. Oh, yeah, you're oh. gonna have to learn all, all that art history stuff, obviously. And it is strange. If you have a good professor, it's really fun. But mm. if your professor is boring, it's, oh, oof. It's a, it's a rough one. <laughs> I can imagine. Just hearing it makes me wanna not. I don't wanna do history. Come on, I'm here to learn uh, art, bro. I took, I took, how many art history classes did I take? I took one, two, three f i took four art history classes the last one that i took was uh animation art history art history animation animation history whatever the hell 
and that class was so boring and it was over zoom because of the pandemic oh, so God. i just like would turn it on and then i would sleep the whole class <laughs> i'd be like okay time for animation history class and then i'd go to bed <laughs> with the zoom on <laughs> just, just take a nap i would <laughs> It's, and it's whatever, I'll get it done. Yeah. I'll it, know. It was the professor. He was just, he didn't really know how to use technology properly. And then he was very dry. And he's dry. teaching art animation. Yeah, animation history. Should oh, be an interesting history. subject, but he... Yeah, it sounds pretty interesting. He did not make it interesting. Wild. All the other times I've done art history were okay, though. Okay, at least. Cause, that means the subject yeah. isn't bad, just the... Uh... Yeah, it's always the professor that does it. Uh, the other professors that I've had for art history were pretty awesome. I like how you're still detailing the cat. Uh, you know, I think that every time I do backseat drawing, I just end up drawing cats. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's a curse. I mean, that, th this time it was my fault. I started it with a, with a cat. Tufels was talking I about can. art history. What did you, what did you say, Tufels? Sat there dead Not listening me. to a guy ramble about the deep meaning behind the toilet. The toilet! Marcel the Ducamp's toilet? urinal. Tufels, I know that. I know that piece. Marcel, have you ever, what? You ever seen Marcel Ducamp's uh, no. urinal? Well, you're going to learn about this. I'm going to bring it on screen. Marcel Ducamp. I might give you an art history lesson on this piece right now. It's called Fountain. Oh, God. Sorry, I thought it was called urinal. So what happened was Marcel Ducamp was working for this art gallery in New York City. And okay. under a different name, he like submitted this urinal into the gallery. And I'm showing pictures of it right now. And then okay, the gallery was like, no, that's not art. That's just crap. So he made a whole big stink about it. And now it's a famous, I don't know if I would call it a sculpture. Someone improved the art by pissing in it? Someone peed yeah. in it? Is that for real? <coughs> Urinal, the changed drinking. art history. I was drinking. I, I did not know that someone all of peed that in it. And it's really dumb. I think that it's probably one of the dumber things of art history. Uh, I have a feeling I'm going to learn a lot of things that are dumb. Urinal pee. I need to find out, did someone really pee in the urinal? <laughs> <gasps> What? They did? He experienced three when he decided to pee in Marcel Ducamp's famous ready made. Someone what? peed in the urinal. Oh my god. You know what? I, I think that that is way better than the original piece. I pee think, I think it's peeing in it. Better. Peeing in it is kind of a statement of like, you just put a stupid urinal in the gallery and I'm going to piss into your urinal. Like, that's kind of <laughs> awesome. But you know what? Okay, I'm, I, I'm getting all hyped up. See, this is what you're going to do in art history class. You're just going to sit and discuss, like, <laughs> is there deep meaning here? Probably not. It's all just, <laughs> it's all just drama. <laughs> Sounds about right, honestly. Uh, honestly, am I all that surprised? Probably not. Probably not. No. Not, not that surprised about this. It, like, the thing is, there, there's a lot, of, a lot of art that just makes me question my own, like, why do I draw? Yeah, you know? you'll start out with the cave paintings, and then eventually you'll get to the urinal. Like, I, I heard about this, like, one person, artist, well, I don't want to call them an artist, but... You know. Oh, no. <laughs> they sold, like, a, like, a blank canvas for God knows how much money recently, uh, and I'm yeah. being like... I think I know what you're talking about. does this... How does this happen? See, that sucks, because I was thinking about doing that. And then this person went ahead and did it first. Or that banana incident that happened recently, where someone taped a banana to a wall and called it art, and yeah. then some guy ate it. <laughs> oh my god, how, how, how? <laughs> it's really how funny. does this work? I walked into class that day, and uh, my professor had taped a banana to the wall of the classroom. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, hmm, this is very relevant to today. <laughs> uh. That will probably be in a textbook pretty soon, I, I would assume. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> yeah, modern art like that, it's just, it's just very weird and strange. Modern art makes, like, modern art that's sophisticated makes me question my own skill that that's, I'm trying to develop, That's you know? sophisticated? What would you define sophisticated. as sophisticated? 
Something that only rich people will buy. Right, right, right. <laughs> you know the you know the it's piece true. I'm There's about. no rich person that's like, can you draw my anime OC? Like, <laughs> yeah, no rich person does that. It, it's only rich people that buy these. It's always like, oh, can it, I? It invokes the emotion of of guilt in me. It's always like, can I buy this vacuum cleaner that you put in a glass box, please? That's ridiculous. Which is a real or or buying shredded pieces of art. Mm, yeah, yeah, Banksy. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. That one's Why not? Right? That's that that was ridiculous too how he shredded it and they bought it anyway. <laughs> Made it worth more it, it's money. It's funny, you know, it, it it it's a statement. That it's true, it's a statement. That that rich people are really goddamn stupid. Well, I think that that it's not just rich people being dumb, but it's also rich people using art to move their money around in yeah, non suspicious definitely. manner. <laughs> Definitely. You know, because a lot of that money is kind of suspicious. And if they have it in assets like art like that, then it's not taxed. Yeah. Especially yeah. in the U.S. So, yeah. That it, just, it just makes me question my life, dude. It gets, a little, um, here like... gets a little hairy in there. Yeah, I question it all the time. Like uh, Jeff Koons, I hate that guy. The guy that made the uh, the inflatable, the it's like this sculpture of an inflatable dog. Like the dog what? balloon. Uh, he makes these sculptures that are like balloon animals and stuff, but they're made out of metal. What really ticks okay. me off is that he does not build them himself. What? Yeah, he has workers that build them for him. That's and not all. I know. I always thought that was ridiculous. Like, why? What is going on? That guy is such an ass. Like, <laughs> hold on. Can I... Jeff Koons. I... I'll, I'll pull up the balloon Can dog. I... He's not the same. I always thought for a while that he was the same guy that did the bean, but that's that's Anish Can Kapoor. Jeff Koons. I'm thinking about Can making a YouTube video on Jeff Koons soon. So no spoilers, but. Like, all these sculptures, I'm showing some on screen, all these sculptures he did not make himself. I'm his, trying to figure out how I can change the, the color of my line art to black. His team does them. Help me, please. His team does them. Yeah. And what's worse is that he's kind of just like a, like a really mean person, so... <laughs> mm, makes sense. And the rich people, they love his, they love his stuff so much. He didn't make it? Yeah, did you know that? I'm sure you recognize his art, right, Two Fools? Yeah, I, 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 by seeing it, I recognize. Yeah, he, is not, he doesn't make any of his stuff, which is crazy to me. Okay, I'm trying to figure out how I can, like, make this, make, make this line art black. God damn it, please, God help me. <laughs> How to color the line art? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I never yeah, color is, my line me. art. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Uh, this might make your whole... Oh, Ac no. Actually, hold on. No, 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 no. Not my cat. I got, I got this, I got this. There we go. Oh, okay. Oh, that is a tactical thing. If I unclip this, this whole piece is going to be pitch black. <laughs> so don't unclip it. I'm, I, I won't touch your layers, you're good. You're all right. <laughs> oh, I see you're using a clipping mask. I see, I see. Yeah, uh, you, see, you, see, you see the tactics? <laughs> I do, I do I see it. Through. It's smart. Yeah. <laughs> the, the, the There's no alpha. Genius. Is this alpha lock? No, no it's not. It's just oh, locking it, locking it. As in you can't draw on it if you lock it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. That makes sense. Sheesh. Okay. Yeah, he did not make I, the balloon I, animals. The prompt was just to draw balloon, to just make balloon animal and metal. I gave them the prompt for what to draw, so I'm the artist. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that's like. <laughs> that's How ridiculous. to steal credit for something 101. Oh my god. And during. I think there was this whole scandal, like during the pandemic, he, f he fired like a ton of his workers. So he we could hire. So he could hire. Yeah, they're the real artists. They're artists. Yeah, they're, they're the artists. He, okay, yeah, smart. He fired a bunch of his artists so that he could hire robots to do the work instead, and I just oh, thought boy. that was the most asshole like move ever. Cause I thought, you know, maybe his vibe is. Your career, you know? Maybe his vibe is like I'm trying to support up and coming artists by giving them a studio to make famous work. But instead, he was like, never mind. I'm gonna fire all these guys and replace them with robots. And ah. Uh, <laughs> Isn't that just 
fantastic. Yeah, he's slightly just a he's, model of a human being. He's just quite quite a bit evil, you know. He's like a super villain in the art world. Makes sense. Honestly, though, this guy sounds like a major asshole. And you will learn about him in art history, and then when you do, you could say, "I'll be like, I hate that guy." <laughs> <laughs> there, he the there he is. There he is. Boostery, I learned. <laughs> After you Look. get through all the cave paintings and the Roman art history and whatnot, I'm kind of excited to learn all that. I'm, I'm, I'm excited to learn like, that's like the really the, old. That's art. like the fun part. And then you get to the modern stuff, and you're like Dada and and postmodernism and Andy Warhol. What's going on? You know, I don't understand. Uh, oh, this is the wrong color. Oh, God help my soul. And for us in the states, it's like. You're extremely lucky if you if you're taking art history in the U.S. and your professor goes over the modern art history of other countries. Otherwise, it's like never it never happens. So let me know if you take art history out, outside the U.S. or Canada. I'll let you know. Let me know if you guys cover other countries, <laughs> because I hope because that sounds like it'd be more fun than sitting there just being like. This country, that, uh, yeah, cool. Bro. Yeah, like we we cover all like the different countries for the older art history, but we never talk about other countries with modern art usually. I I'll let you know. I got lucky with the professor. What if it is just the U.S.? What if even outside? That would be I'm hearing about yeah, that would US. be so weird. I I'm I'm curious. That'd be very strange. I'd be very annoyed if that was the case. We talked a Next little time, bit about... Next time, like a few years later, I come back on Backseat Gaming. So yeah. how's, how's college going? Uh, yeah, they're <laughs> only talking about U.S. artists. I don't know. I don't know what to do anymore. And I'm not even in the U.S. <laughs> yeah, I'm not even in the U.S. Yeah, we they did talk... They love talking about the U.S. We did talk a little bit about Germany. We also talked a little bit about Russia in my class. But only because we had a professor that was... Like, he came into class and he was like... They don't ask me to teach you guys this, but I'm going to anyway. <laughs> we were like, like a, oh. A fun teacher. Yeah. Someone who's actually, you know, smart enough to do something like that. Which was uh, always nice. Rare, rarities in it, life. It is rare, yeah. Okay, my brain is trying to keep up with my own color scheme. This is, uh, what have I done? Yeah, uh, people that draw like you do, I don't understand how you guys do it. <laughs> the thing is, right, I am so not used to the goddamn, goddamn thing. Yeah, the drawing That my software. brain is trying to keep, like, try to figure out how I'm going to, like, transfer how I draw over to this. And let me be honest with you, I'm having a real hard time figuring out that That's aspect okay. alone. It's okay to give up. <laughs> no, 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 no. We don't give up. Cause you paint. I don't. I don't do that. Yeah, I, I paint. So it's uh. Let's see if I can. If I can do it. If I can. If I can paint. I'm I was, praising. I was never much I can. a painter. A digital. I, I, li I like painting. I need to learn it so bad. Digital painting. My professor was like, "You guys all need to learn how to digitally paint." And I'm like, "God damn it! I don't know how Fun. to do that." He said, one of the things I have to learn before I graduate. Okay. I mean, I can, I can help. I'm pretty, I'm pretty okay. It's true. It, I it's think. true. I have a lot of resources. <laughs> I'm, pretty, I'm pretty okay, I think. Yeah, you are pretty Maybe. good at it. I'm pretty bad at it, I'd say. I feel like if there's no line art, I can't do anything. I mean, you can abuse line art, funnily enough. Even in this, you can abuse really? line art. Yeah. A lot of, uh, like, a line art like artists use line art even in paintings they just color it in a painterly way oh, okay yeah so, so it's nice i'll have to experiment eventually when i stop having a billion tons of homework oh my god that'll be that'll be the hard part <laughs> getting time i would like to have a history lecture about modern about commercial illustration in film and modern media? Pfft, yeah, right. It's not gonna happen. Actually, you know, animation art history, even though I slept through it, we kind of talked about some, somewhat that stuff. We talked about animation, which is I want, you commercial. know, I, I, I want to take it in Asia and I, and I preach 
I pray to God they talk about Japan and and and, and what it what it has done. We did, you know. <laughs> no, we talked, mostly. We talked I quite hope. a bit about about Japan. This is Asia. Asia's known for the, the that kind of anime art style. Come on. Yeah, yeah, Come that's on. true. You're in the hot bed of it. <laughs> if I have to hear, oh, cartoony art style. Hey man, Even don't be here. hating. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not hating. I just don't want to hear about it when I'm trying to learn anime art style, okay? Sadly, you'll have to learn all of it. And then in order to get a job, you'll have to be like, for us, and, and like, because I'm an animation major, for us, it's like, well, you have to be versatile in all these styles if you want to get a job. Mm. So I have to know how to make the cute Disney art, which I guess like I'm okay with. I hope I'm okay with it. This cat is a living example of my ability this to cat, make. This cat is good though, damn. My ability damn. to make art that isn't anime. <laughs> uh, mine is mine is not an example. Look, look at this. Hold on. Can can I? But if you only want to work in anime, then it's absolutely okay to just draw anime. And I, I wanna, I wanna be a specifically a, a character designer, but uh, oh yeah, doubt. That's what I'm doubt. in. Kind of. That's kind of what I'm in. There's a lot more than just character design when you look at concept art. Or game art. specifically, you know. Game yeah, character concept. design. Yep. It's tough. My advice to you is to not just do character design. Yeah. Also yeah. do. It's gonna be concept art fully. Draw some cars and shit, and draw some. Yep. It's gonna be the whole shebang, I yeah, know. That's, that's why I want to go to college to begin with, because it'll force me to push outside of my boundaries. <laughs> yeah, very, they, they really challenge you. That they I'm challenge very comfortable. you. I feel that. I'm very comfortable right now, and I don't want to move out of my comfort zone. <laughs> well, if you could paint, you're one, head, you're one step ahead of a lot of people, for sure. If you could paint yes. digitally. You're already like on it. The track. It is it, because I'm going into the industry that I want to go into, right? But if I was like going into animation, for instance, yeah, I would need to know how to do cartoony, and I'd need to know how to line art. Guess what? I can't do. Yeah, I'm in animation, and I I'm... don't actually know how to animate. Uh, we had a big dis mean... we had a big discussion on my stream yesterday about how, like, when I graduate, my bachelor's degree will say animation, but. My major is technically. Oh, sorry. <gasps> my Hold major on. is technically concept art in animation, so I don't yeah. actually animate. But my bachelor's degree will say I will, so it's very complex. <laughs> <laughs> so you might end up with an animation degree, but not actually know how to animate. How to animate? Yeah, yeah that makes that's sense. Chill. It's 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 uh, it's wild though. Tufel said. I have a feet. What did Tufel say? It gets worse. One of my art teachers questioned why I'm trying to learn to draw reality when I could just take a photo. What? What? That person. Huh? That's a person deep down in a very deep hole without any understanding of modern industry. Huh? That's like such a. That's not even boomer. Like what was before boomer? That is. That isn't boomer. <laughs> that actually isn't boomer. That's way worse. What is older than boomers? What was the generation before boomer? <laughs> I, I don't even know. I think they're all died out by now. What a, yeah, they're all dead at this point. But whatever that is, that's what that person is. That was a thing, like, hundreds of... Not hundreds of years ago. But hundreds. Long, yeah, hundreds now you're going of out, years now ago. Now you're, now you're going. When the camera was first invented, they were like, it's the end of painting. Oh, no. <laughs> I wonder how many people actually said that. Oh, my God. A lot. It was a big thing for a while. And then that's why we have modern art. Dude, this cat is like crazy detailed. <laughs> it, it, why is it so detailed? I don't know. I don't know why I did this. <laughs> it, it just keep going. Are you going to keep going? I don't. I guess so. Like, I don't know what else to add. <laughs> <laughs> like, are you, you going to keep like drawing? Highlights? <laughs> like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It continues. I don't know why there's only one brush, dude. No, there's not only we... one. There's like two. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna fall off. But my you chair. could you could change how they how they work. Look, it's it's an in browser drawing program, okay? <laughs> <laughs> true, true. <laughs> 
contain the opacity, the opacity, the hardness, the stabilizer. Yeah, stabilizer. That's so many options. Yeah, you could. Yeah, you could use a stabilizer. I'm lowering that down. Some of them started peeing in toilets and puking paint on canvas. Ew! Stop. That's a real thing. So, well, who was that? Was that the? Was it that he puked the paint onto the canvases, or was it like that he, that he like put. <laughs> <laughs> he like put paint up his butt and then like pooped it out onto what? the can. I can't what? remember which one what it was. It's it a what real thing. <laughs> and the rest of them started to draw dragons instead because why draw reality when dragons exist? It's the basis of being a furry two folds. <laughs> the one I know of was the butt. Yeah, I think it was his butt. <laughs> That's the basis of being a furry. <laughs> Oh my god, it hurts. Please. God. Oh my lord. <laughs> Modern art be crazy. Okay, I got something very similar to the brush I used. Alright, I'm happy. But now we have animation and all is good. But animation... You know how long this took me to, to fix this brush? You Too fixed long. it? What do you mean you fixed it? It was fine. What a great I, it, brush. It was difficult. It, it made it difficult for me to draw, okay? Okay. <laughs> It's still not as good as the one I used, but it's good enough. Oh uh, yeah, it's there's there's a limit to like the quality of the tools that you could get here for sure. It's it's uh it's workable. It, it, this this is this is helping it look like my normal art now slowly. Yeah, it's surely. workable, workable, yeah. Workable. <laughs> there's some, some you're gonna hear me say some dumb shit sometimes. Like I'm gonna just make up a word. You're gonna be like, what? Workable's what? not a word. Is it, it is it not? Is it not? Is it? Is it? Uh, I, I don't know. Wor oh, not worms. Workable. Yeah, it's a word. We're good. Okay, We're yeah. solid. We're solid. Solid, yeah. Animation it's was created by a bunch of furry branch... By the furry branch of artists. Actually, if you want to know the it? truth... No. I'm about to educate you. <laughs> Animation started out in in minstrel shows, which is awful to think about sometimes, but it is true. Animation started out as racist plays about African Americans. At least it did here in the States. I don't know about I see. What, what Japan was up to and the other countries. Japan was probably doing like some tentacle. I, I, yeah, I, I think <laughs> animation started in Japan as pornography. <laughs> I would not be surprised <laughs> that if would I be heard really that. Funny. <laughs> like, it would not because like, oh yeah, population low. We need to the help. We need to help population the, the low. Population. <laughs> <laughs> so they so they made a, a a way to make it even lower. Yeah, I was gonna. Doesn't Japan think that like pornography is causing their population to drop further or it, something? It might. It it might actually be the case. It's all the anime. That, that's, <laughs> that's not even a joke. It might actually be the case. Do you case. think it's actually I don't think it's actually the case. I think that like I, I think it's the work. Yeah, I was just about that's opinion. exactly what I was about to say. I think it's the work. And it's ha I starting to happen like here in the US. <laughs> the US is suddenly like, why aren't these millennials and zoomers settling down and having children? Oh gosh, it's I don't know. We're all poor. It's <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah that, I was about to say that. I don't think I, it's not the work for you guys. It's the oh god, we we don't make enough money for this shit. Yeah, I don't make enough money to afford a child. <laughs> Bro, like what the fuck? Japan was probably running around with swords. I can't say that word on stream. Two fools. <laughs> oh you, yeah, you can. You cannot. I, no, that's that's you awkward. You are gonna table. get. I think Destroyed. their animation industry was actually born after them being nuked. I know that Godzilla came out after they <laughs> He got just nuked. said it. Just being, no, the other word, the one above that in the chat. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> both of them, both of them are bad because... I can't Twitch, talk about Twitch, nukes? Twitch gets mad. Twitch, Twitch gets mad. Well, very mad. Really? With nukes? I don't know if it's specifically nukes, just violence in general. Oh, I was gonna say, like, how many Black Ops streamers, like, <laughs> struggle with <laughs> that, I wonder. 
Like, okay, we're going to uh, Nuketown, and they get banned off of Twitch. <laughs> Dude, that'd be funny though, let's be honest. It'd be very bad to think about, but in this hypothetical, it's very funny. I'm gonna go, oh shit, I just got, I just got banned. Banned street, uh, speedrun, let's go. Yeah, Twitch, Twitch always talking about like how violence is bad on stream, but they, I mean, how many people play such violent video games on stream is insane. It's not just violent video games, like there's so much bullshit on Twitch, just in general, that break their own guidelines but they won't do anything about it because <laughs> it's the top streamers, why would they? I'll never forget that one time that Ninja like switched over to Mixer. We came back. And, and they like, someone hacked into his account and started streaming pornography. And it took them like several I don't know how long it took them to take it down. It was a while. <laughs> Yo, what? That happened? Yeah, it happened. It really did. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I don't keep up with Ninja, so I was like... No, I don't keep up with him either, but I keep up with the Twitch, like, ecosphere. Used? Yeah. Uh, if something crazy like that happens, I, I get a whiff of it for sure. I keep my distance from everything. <laughs> I'm here like, uh, I don't want to hear this like girl streamer did some oh something my got God. bad for two uh, days and came back. I like, hate that so, it's so often. Like that one. It is uh, so often. Oh, we're not even allowed to talk about that one streamer. I think that like if you say her name, the, it activates the Twitch bots or something. There's one Maybe. streamer whose name starts with a, wait. I don't remember what her username is. You can type out the name. To What's her username again? Uh, I think There's it starts, with, it starts with an A. About. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. About. She had like <laughs> a little slip up on stream one time. <laughs> Dude, she says some insane things. She said uh, the is N word she... once oh on stream. She and got... her fans are defending her by saying they, that uh, he said grocery instead. And I'm here like, what do you mean? <laughs> That's so, what do you so mean? bizarre. There's a hard on and everything. It's very strange. She got banned for that nip slip for like I think it was like a day. Like her yeah, whole, I was a whole nip slip. I don't know how that happens. <laughs> she don't, she just wants to generate the buzz, you know. She's uh, starting to fall off. Just she was like, okay, I know what to do. Twitch only cares about money. They censor just enough to make the advertisers and public appearance happy. Very true. Very true. All these big businesses, that's what they really care about is how much they're yeah. making. Yeah, no, definitely. In the end, it's about keeping advertisers happy. Same with YouTube. Actually, is. it is. Yeah, same. same. Same with YouTube, yeah. Keeping advertisers happy. It's a big happy. contract. Un unless it's like something like worthy of going to jail, um, they won't do anything about yeah, it. Yeah, YouTube it's doesn't usually take stuff down they'll demonetize stuff like crazy but they don't always take it down yep as i said unless you're like worthy of going to jail they don't really yeah i find that twitch anything. is way more lenient though with what they yeah, let definitely. slide <laughs> definitely even for the smaller creators yeah just uh you know you know i'll take it but like but like come on if anyone else did what that streamer did, you know, I'm not going to say anything. Yeah, about who well, did. because she's she makes so much money for the platform, right? So yep. if they were to ban her completely, it would be kind of a big loss for the company. Yep, yep. It's a big juggling yep. act. Yep, it is a big juggling act. I can't say I don't, com I don't completely, like, I'm completely like, oh my god, they're such a bad... I get it. You know, I get it, but like... Yeah, I get it too. Yeah. It's just a result of what, what's, what we've built here on the internet, I guess. Yeah. The way that the it's internet just, it's has just become. It's just how it is, you know? yeah. You just gotta, you just gotta... If you, if you get big, like... Like, the thing is, right, it, it works two ways as well. If you get big, you get that, you get that treatment, the special treatment, you know? Mm, the, yeah. The partner treatment. Yeah, the partner treatment. <laughs> but the question is... I don't know if any of us will ever reach that. Hey! <laughs> that's the it's luck based, you know? You I'm not even saying, like, your don't... content's not worthy. Yeah, you don't I think, think it is. You don't think either of us could reach Twitch Partner? <laughs> I, 
I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I can. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be honest with my 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 part. I stream for fun just because of that. And I'm like, you know what? We're not taking this too seriously. I come on, I come on here. I do art. I play some games. Yeah. It doesn't matter how many of you show up. If you show up to have fun, you show up to have fun. I cool. feel that. I'm kind of. I think I've been pushing the envelope a little bit further than I usually have this year. Like with trying to grow the stream. I don't know if anyone notices that or not. Probably no one notices it, but I don't know if I'll ever hit Twitch partner. That sounds crazy. Right? Yeah. Like, like just saying it out loud. I think it's like 70 like, average viewers or something that 75. you need. Oh my god, dude, I'm barely hitting. I think I just hit like like five or something the other day. <laughs> yeah, I, I hit four like a few weeks back. And I, I was like, I know four? That this past week, my average viewer count has been up though. It's been like, like around like six sometimes. And I'm like, ooh, <laughs> six. Yeah, that's nice, that's nice, that's nice. <laughs> We're on the up my, and up. <laughs> if I do art streams every day, I get like seven viewers like often enough showing up so I, I know I can if I exclusively do art I can get seven viewers there problem problem here is seven isn't 70 yes <laughs> 70 is so many <laughs> this laptop this cat is perfect for sending to a printer and getting made into a laptop sticker well it is actually, though. I'll think about it <laughs> I'll think I'll consider it's it it's very cute not going to even even lie even josh here not even joshing with you it's pretty not adorable. even josh i'll, I'll just make an uh, angry anime boy well me yeah <laughs> you're just drawing myself your angry anime boy it's it's the it's the one thing i have a lot of practice drawing okay it's just yeah for me it's cats <laughs> I default to the thing I know how to draw most, and this, sadly, this is what I draw most. I feel that. I just draw I mean, whatever, whatever I have to for class, that's what I draw. That's gonna be me at some point soon, <laughs> no. Whatever this they tell like... me, whatever they tell me to do, I do it. <laughs> like, uh, god, that, that day is gonna be sad, I'm gonna be like, yeah, prostro, I, I just draw what they want. Yeah, I suddenly, don't have any freedom anymore. Suddenly, this is not a hobby anymore. <laughs> suddenly, suddenly, this suddenly, this isn't fun anymore. <laughs> suddenly, they want me to do shit. God damn it. That's when you, like, should start looking for other, like, hobbies to replace drawing in, oh, your, yeah, definitely. in your heart. <laughs> definitely. I, pl I, 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 I play the guitar a bit. Oh, like, that's good. When I say a bit, I, I literally do mean this. Very little amounts. Let me be clear. I don't want you getting the wrong idea here. Okay. And not even enough to call myself anything worth a damn. <laughs> when I started college, I like got really good at cooking. So I think that that's my replacement hobby. hobby. Yeah. Except there's no. I don't have a kitchen here, so it's like the most useless hobby ever right now. Like, they're I just, can't. They're like, oh, I wish I could cook. I know. There's nowhere for me to cook. I just. My dorm just has a fridge. <laughs> There's no kitchen. That's that's sad. Electric stove? Buy one? Oh, we're not allowed. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. We're not allowed to have an electric stove. They're scared it's gonna like blow up the building and stuff. Oh my lord, help me <laughs> so please. <laughs> oh. I, I don't want to live in a dorm. I I, I know I know I'm going. I know I'm going to Malaysia. I don't care. Apartment life. I'm not living in a dorm. Apartment life apartment. style. Yeah. yeah apartment. I feel I'm that. not living in a dorm. I don't care. It. I can. I can get shot before I'm gonna start that. I did not start feel, that life. I did not feel like looking for apartments. I was like, I'm. I don't care anymore. I'm just gonna sit in a dorm somewhere. All right. The painting starts now. Oh my lord. Hold on. <laughs> Had a oh, friend God. in uni when they started, oh, they lacked a kitchen fan, so the only thing cooked was pesto pasta. <laughs> no fan, oof. No oh, searing meat, Lord. that's for sure. No cooking. Frying a sausage? Too much smoke. You gotta open a window. That's one way to set up all the alarms. So yeah, we're not even allowed candles in, in the building or anything. There's a lot of things we're not allowed. 
candles and like. Sounds like honestly sad though. Hot plates. We're only allowed like one extension cord per person. <laughs> Very strange. One extension cord per person? What is yeah. that rule? I don't know. I think they just don't want us to blow the place up. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's a way of going about it. I, I no one's blown no one's blown up this building yet, so we're well I think we're doing well. <laughs> yeah. Think, seems so. I think most American colleges like say no to candles and such though. So it's pretty common. That's not all that surprising though, that makes sense. Yeah. How am I gonna reduce what these? What happens two if down? I what happens if I merge these layers? Oh it worked. <laughs> Look at the kitty. Uh, Very cute. Very cute cat. I sit here in my family's second home with a garden and washing machine and no neighbors for 95% of the year. Damn, two fools, I'm moving. Two fools, I'm coming over. I'm moving in. <laughs> <laughs> two fools living the good life, honestly speaking. Dude, facts. <laughs> to be fair, I don't, have a, I don't have a roommate, so it's pretty chill. That's at least. Yeah. That's at least something. I had to convince my school of that one. I was like, I'm mentally ill, can I have no roommate? And they were like, yeah, I guess so. So, good for me. <laughs> Is that the hoop you gotta jump through? Yeah, yeah. Oh, or you could say, like, oh. if you actually have something physically wrong, you could probably pull it. But apparently they, they give, like, single rooms here to people with, like, peanut allergies, too. So it wasn't, oh. it wasn't too hard to get. I need to mow the lawn though. Why do why do people have lawns? <laughs> yeah, it's not that bad. Tufel's mowing the lawn. It's not that bad. I mean, it it isn't that bad, honestly. No, you'll be all right. You should plant some flowers out there. That's what lawns are for, Tufel's. It's because it looks pretty, and you could plant potatoes and such, <laughs> and tomatoes and whatnot. Some a dandelions. Got a point. I don't know why, like, I swap between calling you apostrophe, because I, I just like saying it that way, and apostrophe. Yeah. Like how it's supposed to be said. It is a, it is apostrophe. Yeah, with the two O's. With the poo, yeah. Yeah. The, the, the poo is included. You wanna, you wanna rephrase that? <laughs> the, with a poo. Uh -huh. I've, I've changed my, my raid call to, like, a poo raid, so it looks like we're talking about poop. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no, when I go on a raid, people. <laughs> <laughs> that, that would confuse most people. They're always like, are you sure you want to say that about yourself? I'm like, yes. It's <laughs> exactly what I want to say when I go on my raids. <laughs> Just to show people, yeah. Right, let me see how much of a difference this is adding. Oh, nice. We have blueberries in Clean. an herb garden. Oh, maintaining that is a lot of work. My mom's hobby whenever she's here. That's what my mom does too. My mom gardens like crazy. She's crazy at gardening. Wow. Now I'm doing highlights in these whiskers. Getting pretty bonkers over here if you ask me. Oh my God. I'm surprised. You're like, yeah, I'm gonna stop drawing this cat. Well, I don't know. I, I don't know what else to draw. Just. <laughs> This is what I got, okay? Uh, I don't have the brain energy. Before this stream, I was like napping. Took a big nap. Uh, and I then I see. and then I woke up at like 4:40. I'm like, "Oh my gosh, I got to I got to go." <laughs> so it's <laughs> so know, before this, I was just I was just gaming. I was like, "All right, boys, let's go. That's, Apex." Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> at some point, we'll have to end because I'll like be so hungry that I won't be able to draw anymore. Probably. Uh, <laughs> eventually, I'll, understandable. eventually I'll need nutrients, but we'll see when that happens. Shouldn't you like grab some snacks? No, I had breakfast this morning, but it wasn't, I mean, it wasn't that early, so I should be okay. I woke up late. Okay. When did you plan this combo stream? Uh, a bit ago. I think it was like Monday, right? Yeah. I think yeah, it was Monday. I think, so. I think, I think it was like, like a week or two ago. Roughly. No, a week ago. Nah, it wasn't even ago. like a, it was like this earlier this week, wasn't it? <laughs> it, it wasn't it before Friday? <laughs> no. Wait. I don't think uh, so. No, it was. It was. It was on like 
Yeah, because you were like, uh, not this Friday, next Friday. Oh, you yeah, I did say that. Yeah, yeah. yeah so it's yeah. been a week. All right. <laughs> That's how I remember things. I, I remember snippets of conversation, and I'm like, oh. I just tuned in because Apostrophe was online and was confused when I heard Enan. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I, you're like, oh, wait, why, why is Enan here? Did I not advertise it enough? I don't know. No, you, did. You, did, you did. You did advertise it. I thought I talked you about did. it a little bit here and there on stream about how backseat drawing on. was coming back. You're a mod, Tufels. What are you doing? You put the put the Twitch Twitch note in the, in the announcements. <laughs> I forgot to do that. Hold on. Uh, oh, on you're on your thingy. <laughs> yeah, podcast. Wow, I get my own shout out. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> there we go. Two fools, uh. What a what a what a bad mod. Oh my gosh, two fools. How could you be here and not do that? Two fools so scary. Yeah. <laughs> see, see? There you go. God, such a such a <laughs> oh, the last time we had this podcast was like so so long ago. I think I have it on YouTube. Yeah, I was like surprised that it is gonna be live i was like it's live normally wait a minute yeah hmm? nine months ago <laughs> jesus it's the last time that we did it so we almost we did it within a year another episode that's pretty good <laughs> you know i used to do a podcast every week right every week who art cast yeah or... we're art casting right now hell yeah but um i drew uh, drew I, I i had a podcast that i did in 2000 16? Yeah, it lasted up till like uh, two months into 17, so it started around like. Wow. No, o October. It, it started around October. That's consistent. And uh, I went for like. Um, 15 episodes came out. Every week I, I, I recorded it. Dang. I don't know how I did it. <laughs> I never want to do that again. <laughs> I'm sitting here like trying to do it. <laughs> I'm like, guys, it, should it's do it hell. every week. <laughs> it's it's hell. It's not that it's bad. Hell. I feel. I mean, okay, when when you're doing like an art cast and you just get to draw and, and chill, mm -hmm. it's not that bad. I was doing like a like a we gotta find topics. So every week I was like scouring the internet. Okay, but to I find have anything. I have a list of like questions and stuff. Welcome, sweet and spooky, to the chat. Yeah, well, that's one of my other mods. You oh. better you be nice here, sweet. Oh, I swear to God. Oh, you're a mod. You're not a mod here, though. <laughs> you, be, you be nice. Be nice. <laughs> yeah, that's the only rule of the chat is be, be nice. And don't say anything s too stupid and you'll be okay. And when I mean stupid, I mean don't get yourself in trouble and then I'll have to punish you. <laughs> don't say anything that would incriminate yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I will. I'm too drained to. Oh my god. <laughs> See, this is this is the problem with my chat being here. They're just uh really annoying sometimes. <laughs> oh dear, you have no idea who I am. What I mean is just don't be like, don't say like a slur or anything. And then, uh, no, she, she won't do that. And then we'll she be won't good. Then we'll be good. <laughs> she just, uh, she can be annoying. <laughs> I don't, I don't usually, I, mm, I've banned a couple people be on Twitch. Yeah, I'm being honest. I don't do slurs solid, then you should be okay. I am annoying. I <laughs> see okay. you and she admits okay. it. I have a couple annoying people already, so you're, you're, you're good. <laughs> I already cope with the ones that I have. Them? Do you the, name them out? Do you, do you just like, hey, I'm yo, not I am funny? not going to call out who is the annoying people <laughs> in the chat. You know who you are. I, Some. I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I call them out all the time. I think that some <laughs> I think that some of my viewers don't realize how annoying they are sometimes. I don't want any of you guys to get existential about that. But some of y'all <laughs> uh. No, I feel that though. Oh I, my I get it. I some get of it. you guys come in here and you'll tell me stuff and I'm just like, what are you going on about? I am Chirko, it's <laughs> Chirko, it's not you. <laughs> Just so you know, I get very... Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Thank God I don't have to worry. God damn it. I'll just be passive-aggressive. Also... <laughs> I'll just be passive-aggressive. Yeah. 
Uh, I'm just like, no, it's definitely not you, obviously. <laughs> obviously. <laughs> no, I'm definitely annoying. I come in here and I talk about some magic. Get very Trust lewd me. when I'm in the mood to be annoying? Yeah. Oh, whoa, dude. Yeah. <laughs> that's what that's what I said. That's why I said. That is like know? that is a vibe that I don't have here. Yeah, that's the vibe that I don't like having either. So Spooky Spooky came close to being banned a few times. I used to be to wholesome be and friendly. Tufels, you're like one of the nicest people in my chat. He is up. still. He, he blames me for it, you know? He is like one of the nicest little humans. He blames me for his downfall into being mean. There's no downfall. He's not mean. He's so sweet. <laughs> God. Uh, my mouth had gotten much fouler. Don't blame no. me. Oh, <laughs> Not that emote. <laughs> time out. True, true. I did say time out. True. That is true. Oh my gosh. But no. that's because I'm a kind ruler. Not the, Not ga not the gasm emote going on. Chico, I cannot believe this. <laughs> you know, I, 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 I am going to be really sad for the YouTube watchers. I mean, like, they're just talking to, to stream. What is this? Is this just a bot? <laughs> Yeah, it is a VOD. It'll be a VOD, yeah. They just have to deal with the fact that I've... Well, I usually I don't include chat in backseat drawing, but, like, I started to feel bad. Oh, my Pablo. I started to feel bad, so I decided to include them today in the mesh. Mm -hmm. Especially since we're both streamers. Previous... I don't mind. I am completely down. Previous backseat drawings, it was like, well, the other person doesn't have too big of an audience or something, so... They don't care. Mm. I see, okay. You were taking advantage of people not knowing what tetas means. You have tetas emotes? Yeah, but it's it's my cat, Chiaco. It's not not safe for work. <laughs> I have a titty emote. Did you know this, Enan? What? <laughs> uh yeah, what well, it's not actually boobs, right? I okay. have I assumed I, that. So we joke about I talk about boobs on my stream titties i talk about titties on my stream all the time seems to come up all the time and i always say titties in spanish as in tetas so i was trying oh, okay. i was trying to find a way to integrate a titty emote into my stream and my cat had she's like a little chunky so she kind of has like cleavage she's got a little yeah. bit of cleavage so i made an emote of her boobs and it's the Tetas <laughs> emote. So we have a we have a boob emote, but it's like <laughs> I'm like, how can I get this past Twitch where they won't notice that I made a boob emote? And I, I think it's working. <laughs> I, I see, yeah. I see it. I see it. I, yeah. Now that I'm like looking at it completely, like with my eyes. To like... be fair, my cat really does have like like boobs. Like she I really, see. she really does have that little. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny though. That's brilliant. That's well funny. done. Thank you. Yeah, it took it took me a while to be like, how can I make a booby emote? Twitch allows that. that Twitch like allows that gasm emote thing. So I figured it would be okay to just have my cat's boobs. Like I didn't. I was like, there's no way I'm gonna get in trouble with this when they have this other thing going on here. Like when you go onto the emote rules section of Twitch where you can read all the guidelines for emotes, it was like, gasm emotes are permitted. And I'm like, they had to like say that specifically there. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, well then they should probably be okay with my cat's boobs. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> A way to get around the system. Yeah, and it, and it worked. They, it is good. It has been allowed. But I do have that, I have like that auto thing where when you submit an emote into Twitch, it like auto accepts it. Oh yeah, I, I have that yeah. too. So they have too much it's faith. Great. Too much faith in me. So they it's didn't, great. they I, didn't, I they didn't actually approve it. So there's still a chance that maybe one day Twitch, Twitch staff Looks at it. is like, yeah. what, what really is this? <laughs> Which is why yeah, being a... Just, uh... Being a small streamer rocks because you could fly under the radar with like so much more. I, I have a feeling being like a mid-range streamer sucks. Auto accept? It's like, yes. Because of the fact that, you know, yeah, you're making money, but you don't get to do dumb shit. 
Yeah, you're making money, but it's not enough to support you yet. And yeah. also, Twitch is now officially watching you closer. Looking at you, yeah. That's yeah. so scary. That's such a loss. <laughs> sounds. It sounds like really annoying, honestly. It's like every now and then I'll stream a copyrighted show, and no one will know. <laughs> <laughs> they have no idea. Oh God! Why? Why? Why is this so difficult? <laughs> My paintings. Looks looks weird. Looks weird. Damn, how are you doing that in this program? <laughs> <laughs> it takes a few days for Ardan's emotes to be accepted. Wow. Has he yeah, messed I, up? I have auto. Has he messed up like once before where he did something? No, no, was she, the, the thing is, some people get it and some people don't. On top of that, really? uh, she's big enough, quotes, to the point where people would be looking, in my opinion. You know, and I think, right? I don't know what it is when they give you the auto emote thing. Like, how do yeah. they how do they choose you? She's the most wholesome. She averages she about ten wholesome. to twenty people. That's more than me. <laughs> I'm trying to get to that number. Ten? Ten average viewers would be so hype. Or would it? Who knows? Could go either Who knows? way. I don't know. Depends it, on could, it depends on who's, yeah. <laughs> who's, who's who are the viewers? <laughs> I have auto to, like, accept. Yeah, Chiaku, you. you have a higher viewer count than me, probably, as well, so. You don't have to tell us your number, Chiaku, but I, that's okay. But I, I know that you do. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen your stream numbers. <laughs> oh my gosh, my back. My back. Artist, artist. Oh, uh, sometimes I hate painting. Artist like back. right now. Yeah. Because firstly it looks weird in my opinion. Secondly, uh what what is it? Um painting takes like a decade. I'm sitting here painting and I'm like, ah oh god, why am I doing this to myself? Hey painting is You're good. gonna feel that when you start. Painting's good for you. And you'll feel that <laughs> when they force you to learn line art. Yeah, true, true. Because with concept Actually, art, they're going to be like, you have to do just the inks of these characters and whatnot. Oh, God. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It could go either way when you go to school. You'll suffer one way or another. Oh, of course. Suffering is, is guaranteed. It'll be... It'll be a, Doesn't a life guarantee thing. that, though? Suffering? Yeah. Yeah. Well, especially art. I gotta be careful with how I do this. I want the all their mm. all her Discord emotes are there because she needed to test emotes to see how they look. I think my disc I think my Discord emotes are my Twitch emotes, but Same. they're only available for subs. Like we I don't okay my Discord is boring. <laughs> my Discord is literally just a way for me to ping people so that they know that I'm streaming. Mine is basically the same realistically. <laughs> I won't say mine is like all that different from that. Sometimes yeah. I join in there and talk to people, but like, rarely do people join to talk to. So I'm like, you know what? Nah. Yeah, I guess I don't I, even I don't even chat in there. So what am I expecting people to do? Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> My Discord game is weak. People are more likely to DM me and talk to me in DMs than they are like in, they are, in my yeah. public my public Same. Discord. Done a lot of it's kind of sad. commissions. Oh, that's smart to do them in the Discord rather than on your. Yeah, that's smart. She's smart. Do you do it on on your? Oh, I don't take emote commissions. Okay. But I mean, if you were to take emote commissions rather than testing them on your own, like Twitch. I mean, thing, that's what I do as well. You could test, test them, on them on the Discord. Discord. I never even thought that. I'm a little. I'm a little bit of an egghead, but you know. whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I like submit them like, to wait Twitch. A minute. Yeah, I just made our first animated emote uh, yesterday. I can't animate. <laughs> no, I, I've been wanting to do it, and I'm here like, how do I do it? Uh, it's hard. I don't even know how to animate. <sighs> I just know how to do concept stuff. It's my cat like barfing rainbows. It's really cute. Oh, I, I show. I saw it. Yeah, I, I, oh I showed gosh. up yesterday. Right. Yeah, you were here yesterday. For so a little good. bit. Now I'm, I'm like trying to I'm trying to take on yeah I'm trying to take on an even more ambitious emote now of me pulling a sword, 
out and like well, that's gonna be... pointing it and I have done the sketch for it and oh man it's tough it's tough I imagine so I imagine it, it, it'd be pretty rough yeah but Twitch has that thing where they could auto animate emotes for you if you want them to like just jitter or something if you, want, if you want it to just like shake or move on the screen I could do a like a raid emote that just shakes. Yeah, I'm trying to make a raid one. That's the sword one. I thought that'd be cool uh, if we like point the sword like we're going on the attack. Two yeah, will you send me it. a link? What is this? I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh my god. Oh, okay. That's a good thing. <laughs> it's just emotes. Ew. Is the, the biting the finger one there is so good. <laughs> Can I steal Can this idea? It. That's so funny. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a lot of I, I, quite a few of my first emotes oh that I made God. were were stealing from RTA. Gotta be honest. <laughs> Some of these are so good. Oh my gosh, I've seen these emotes. Obvious, I've definitely seen them. The finger bitey one is so funny. <laughs> the main one I copied for a while was a heart emote. It's not in here, but oh, they're these are really good. Can, I tried... can twofold. Can you can you put the heart emote in here? Look oh, at the zombie heart emote. Which one? Let's see. Oh, this. Oh, that one's so good. What the heck? I struggle with emotes. I'm trying to. I try to make all of my emotes myself. I feel like since I'm an art stream, I have to do all the art on my stream. And I'm not that. I'm not that good at it. My emotes always look slightly like I feel like they look too small or something. Yeah, I feel that too. Mine. I'm like, how do I the get the only them? good emote I have is this one, I think. Hold on. Uh, where are you? This one. But it's because it's Sundere and everyone loves it for some reason. <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> I wonder why. That one's cute. I think my best one is the is the one where I'm like praying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that one is pretty sick too. The praying one. Pray. Like it just looks like clean, and you could see what it is. But all my other emotes yeah. feel small. Maybe the cat butt one is pretty cute too, I guess. That one's pretty funny. <laughs> Hold on, all right. Continuing, continuing this painting that doesn't look good enough. Hey man. The problem. It's all so good. It's, it's the artist's problem, right? It's all You're good. Just like... It doesn't have to be perfect. You're just on a podcast vibing. Like, you don't have to make the Mona Lisa. True, true. We're just... I, I just you know, you know how it is. If all you, else, you make a... if all else fails, I have like nineteen, and I know it's nineteen. I wish it was twenty. It bothers me. Nineteen questions. Some of them are art prompts. Oh. For this podcast. Oh. It will... I did not know we had prompts. I was like, well, I was they're... trying to keep the topics going. They're for just in case. <laughs> I'm pretty good at talking, as you can. They're for clearly. just in... some. I... There's only been a couple occasions where I've had to use prompts. But I can prompt you if you want. I mean, I'm down. Prompting sounds fun. But some of them are drawing prompts, so we might have to draw. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm finishing this up. Come on. Oh, my God. Okay. I'll, okay. Uh, well, I'll only, if it's a drawing prompt, I'll ask you to pick a different one. So okay. you could pick a, pick a number between 1 and 19. 1 and 19. Mm, 9, because that's my favorite number. Yeah, okay. Any movies, games, or shows that scared you as a kid? Scared me as a kid. Courage the Cowardly Dog did it. Yo! All the time. <laughs> All the time. That scared the ever-loving shit out of me. That episode with, with the face in the basement? Dude, do you remember the one with, oh. like, like the, like, the scarecrow thing that was, like, just outside the house? Like, Ooh. like oh my god. That show... God. That show freaked me out too. Although I wasn't always allowed to watch it, to be fair. I wasn't allowed to watch it, but I'd wake up sometimes at 3 a.m. as a kid and I'd be like, ah, oh, let me just watch a, watch like something. But then I turn on the TV and it would be on. 3 a.m. Like, yeah. <laughs> that's like the, I, that's because like that's, that's when, when it would show up. That's when King of the Hill was on. <laughs> For me, that's when it, uh, the Courage the Cowardly Dog would play. So I'd be like, alright, let's, let's watch Courage the Cowardly Dog. Eh? It, it's a cartoon. It's not gonna scare me. And then it did do it, 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 it scarred me, and I did like, oh. Oh my gosh. What? That was, that, that was something terrifying. That, that like show, specifically. 
as my, a kid. My mom was always like, you can't watch it because the old man says the word stupid and that's a bad word. And I'm like, that's <laughs> that's your reason for me not, not want, being able to watch it. It's because he says stupid. Rocat and Rocat and said, oh. yeah, Rocat said if you got if you need questions, you gotta ask. Yeah, I'm afraid of Rocat. Really? She, I know I know her very well. <laughs> she's my she's my best mod. Oh, so the best! Yeah. Wow, top yeah, top of the game. The Rocat's been top over here game. a couple times. Well, I you, know, I know. You you're free to ask questions to either yeah, of us. Yeah, you know what? Sure. Yeah, I mean, I'd, I'd like to see what you got. Preferably not asking me questions. This is supposed to be about Enan. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she gets to ask me questions all the time. She watches me most of the time. I'm the evil mod. <laughs> uh, she, she just says that. She thinks that. Truth be told, I really don't have any mods. <laughs> I am what? the mod. Yeah, I don't really, I don't really have any mods. That's the fun of it. Yeah, I know. I I just uh I never got around to it. <laughs> I was scared of Teletubbies. I mean, I get it. I get it. <laughs> I love the Teletubbies. Stop. Dude. I get it. What's the what's the the little purple one's name? I don't remember. Tinky Winky. <laughs> you Damn. said you love it. I, yeah. You... Well, I, as a kid, I loved it. I used to okay, love right. Teletubbies, and I still think that it's pretty cool. Teletubbies is pretty cool. Like that whole set with the grass and stuff and all the puppets and whatnot. Is pretty, I, that's pretty awesome. I've always been afraid of like clown type things, so they're not like, clowns. I I know I know I know no. This is not a this is not a this is not related <laughs> to Teletubbies at all. Uh, when like in Ben Ten there was like a very specific episode with like a clown uh, enemy and I, that shit scared me for days. Favorite Teletubby? Definitely the purple one. What's the purple one's name? I don't even have one. Purple I don't even. I haven't Teletubby. watched enough Teletubbies is to it, know. Is it? Is it? Is it a? What's its name? I said his name. Tinky Winky. Yeah, I got it right. Tinky Winky. <laughs> Wait, a, what? Jerry Falwell and Tinky Winky, the gay Teletubby. What is this article? He is purple, the gay fry, the gay pride color, and his antenna is shaped like a triangle. I never even thought of that. Tinky Winky is the gay Teletubby. He's ten feet tall. Oh my god. <laughs> ten feet tall? Wait a minute. <laughs> That's not scary. Dipsy That's was that... lit. <laughs> the little yellow one is really cute. That's true. At least I think that's what, the one that you're talking about. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Ever considered the fact that people in the suits are full adult size? They're taller than full adult size. So the suit makes them taller. I think yeah. that like I think that where they see out of is is the mouth or something. So it makes them even huger. Favorite art medium? Uh, ink art and watercolor for sure. Hmm. It's my favorite medium. You could say digital. digital. Yeah, you're allowed. Uh, sorry. You're allowed uh, sorry, to say guys. there's nothing wrong with it. <laughs> uh, sorry, guys. I, I really, I really like my tech. Okay. I really like my watercolor. <laughs> Seeing photos from behind the scenes is terrifying. Yeah. The, if you ever have time, look up some behind the scenes photos of the Teletubbies. It's absolutely horrific sometimes to see those images. <laughs> You know what? Okay, now, now that I've gotten done, basically done with the face, I'm almost done with the face. Whenever I'm done with the face is when I'm done with this goddamn thing. Because I, I, if I continue this, this'll, this'll, this won't just be this stream. It'll be like seven streams later I'll finish. <laughs> the problem with painting. Take your time. <laughs> I keep well, adding I things to this cat and I, I'm running out of things to add. <laughs> I, I know, that's why I'm trying to hurry up. I'm also trying to think about a like a cartoon or a movie or something that scared me when I was a kid. That I'm trying to think of ones that aren't actually scary because all the you things. Play games. Hold on, I I've, I've, I have a prompt for you. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> what game? What game's your favorite game? Gamer, gamer questions. My favorite video game of all time, and I got asked this during my Panera Bread interview, by the way. So keep your eyes peeled if you're getting interviewed one day. <laughs> Is Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky. Okay, Pokemon Mystery Dun Dungeon is pretty good. That's my pretty favorite good. game of all time. My second favorite game is Minecraft. 
<laughs> what is your favorite video game? Oh, it's Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Real, God, that's that like not sick. anything like mine. <laughs> that's all sick. Yeah, it's because I, I'm just a, okay, from my art, okay, alone, you can tell that I like action scenes a lot. Yeah. I've never been a big Still. action gamer, I guess. Yeah, I, I play a lot of action games. I'm not a FPS person, so not my sort of thing playing FPS games. But mm. I do love me my, uh, my, my, you know, hack and slash games. I they do, are... I like Black Ops Zombies. Oh, Black Ops Zombies was sick, though. That's so much fun. Original? Uh, yes. And the second, the second game as well. Second was one too. was pretty good too. Yeah. Maybe even better than the first. Dare I say? I, I, I'm, I'm gonna say yeah, it was <laughs> on, honestly speaking. <laughs> Some people might might get a little match, but uh. Mm, Black Ops too bad. I don't think I don't think anyone in chat is, or my YouTube viewers are like big Black Ops people, and they're gonna get mad they're at good. us for yeah, like, <laughs> saying that Black like... Ops Two is better than Black Ops One. Is <laughs> that such a <laughs> hot be... take? It's not. It's not that uh, that much of a hot take, I think. I don't hopefully. know many. I don't know many Black Ops fans, like hardcore Black Ops fans. Are they real? <laughs> are they real? Oh, <laughs> they, are, they, are. <laughs> they are real. I, I think. If you had I to think pick, they're real. If you had to pick one fandom to draw art from now on, what would it be? Uh, this is an obvious answer oh, for me because I've drawn. I don't know art. mine. I don't know. <laughs> I've mine. drawn draw a lot of fandoms. I've drawn a billion pieces of fan art already for Revolutionary I Girl have a Utsuna. Yeah, I had a feeling. And I, I could probably draw a billion more. Yeah, <laughs> Chieko. Um, Roka, it'd probably be Fate, just because there's like fate. the Fate, fate fan franchise entirely because. There's so much waifus in that. Like <laughs> you're thinking of like and, a different and husbandos. thing. You're like there's and so husbandos. many women for me to draw. <laughs> and, and husbandos. Let me be clear. And husbandos. <laughs> and there's Gilgamesh, which is what my character is based off of. So I've never seen you know, Fate. Never. Uh, you're missing out. I'll get missing there. Out. I I'm trying to watch other shows currently. <laughs> I remember the first time I came in, in here and you asked me what my character was based off of because I do remember this. And you were like, uh, oh, I, I want to get to watching Fate back then. Oh, so that was probably like four years ago. <laughs> it was wild. Yeah, I'll watch Fate. I'll get around to it. No, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> Eventually I will. But I like I started watching One Piece during my winter break. Oh, and uh, it's going to take me a while to get through that one. So Yeah, it's, it's definitely going to take you not a while, a lifetime. Nah, I know a lifetime. I could I could binge that, but I have to really commit. Like I'm not fully committed yet. Yeah. I mean fate's good. Fate's fun. Yeah. Uh, the problem is Just don't just don't just don't talk to the fandom. Just, just, just really? Are they this. really that bad? It uh, everyone has their own opinion on how you should go about watching it. Like, I was just, just watch it, dude. I was just gonna watch it in the order that it was released, the anime. Yeah, that, that's a, that's a good idea to watch it. If as you a, as watch a it as an artist, I like watching things like in that specific order. Evolve. Yeah, because yeah. I like seeing the art. I like it the too. art evolve. That's my favorite. Yeah, same, same. Like that's. But I watched it in release order too. So. Yeah, that's the same thing with Monogatari. People always ask me like, what what order should I watch this in? And I'm like, I don't know. You could watch it in release order, and you'll you'll get to see the art progress, and it's pretty fun. Yeah, that's what I do, but uh. A lot of people like the story to make sense. Nah. So they go with like a like a more, you know, not that kind of way. Yeah, they're like go chronological or something. Nah, who yeah. needs chron The thing is there is no chronological with fate. Right. There is fate's got all zero. The <laughs> yeah, zero's the the beginning of the series by all technicality. But if you watch zero first, you get spoiled on some of the things in the in the in 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 the in the original, you know? So you're like what do I do? So what ends up happening with Fate fans is they they just say don't watch it. <laughs> don't, the answer to your question is don't watch it. <laughs> I figure I'll just I figure because release order that's like kind of how they intended it to be. It's the way they. It's not that they intended in, it to be. Well, that they way, I don't they think. intentionally released it in that order. Like yeah, someone behind definitely. the scenes made that decision. I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> okay, if you're gonna watch it in release order. Yes. I heard they've, that the first season sucks or something. 
they butchered the shit out of the first anime. Okay? <laughs> they butchered it. Oh, it's so... my favorite path too from the uh, visual novel. Yeah. Um, sorry. The, yeah, yeah, because it's a game. Um, it's my favorite path too, but they butchered it to hell. It's not bad, in my opinion, but the story and the, the voice acting and everything really shows. You know, you're just going to be like, what? What did the main character just say? <laughs> People die when they die. Wow. <laughs> he actually says that, by oh. the way. I'm excited. If it's like cringe but bad, then I'll be okay. I, if it's, it's not cringe, if it's like cringe, it's like... If it's like cringe but in a good way, so bad it's good. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll be okay. But like I, th- I think you're you're still gonna enjoy it. It's just gonna be like you're gonna enjoy the other ones way more. I think you're gonna enjoy Unlimited Blade Works the most, unless you become a Kiritsugu fan. Then you're gonna enjoy Zero way more than all the others. <laughs> is that really where the fun. people die when they are killed line is from? <laughs> yes, yes, that is. <laughs> I didn't where know the, that either. That it's is so where funny. It's from. Nah, I've I you watch Star Wars chronological twofolds? Ooh, I. I, uh... I, I haven't watched Star Wars, so... Okay, well, I'm, if you do, I'm don't do that. Game. I don't recommend that. I, I like the mystery of watching the originals first, because there's, like... Have you had have you ever had Star Wars spoiled to you? Do you know the big twist or whatever? I do not, but I don't care. <laughs> okay. I'm probably not gonna watch it. You should watch Star Wars. What's wrong with you? At least watch the first three movies. <laughs> I think I have watched the first three movies Essential because my friend viewing. was, like... Hey yo, you haven't watched the Star Wars movie? Come on, man, let's do it. And I was yeah. like, okay. The first Bye. three Star Wars films are amazing. After that, it just gets worse and worse. I feel every single time. <laughs> Everyone says that. I'm not I'm interested like, uh, in the new Kingdom Hearts game coming out. Are you? Me? Yeah. This is no. Ad. I'm not really a. I've never played. I'm Kingdom not really Hearts. a Kingdom Hearts fan. Yeah. yeah. It's like a weird thing for me. I'm not, you know. People can like it. I just don't like the the whole Disney characters and the whole. You know how it is. It just it feels weird to me. I'm just they're like, eh. You don't like having eh. Goofy around in your RPG? No, no. <laughs> I'd rather not have Goofy around in my RPG. Thank you very much. It's so funny. <laughs> I isn't it like a PlayStation game most of the time? Yeah, it is most of the time. Uh, yeah, I've never owned. I've never owned a PlayStation, so that's why I've never played it. Persona games though. Yeah, Persona I've, games though. I've never played a Persona game because I've never owned no, a PlayStation. <laughs> you should get the you should get Persona 4. It's uh, it's out on uh, PC now. Um, oh, they okay. finally released it. Yeah, I didn't know that. It's really really good. Yeah, I play. I mean, I've played uh, the new Shin Megami Tensei game on uh, okay, good. on Switch, and that's awesome. I really love that game. Yeah, that, if you like if you like that, you're gonna like. Fun. Good, good. It's fun. Persona 5, it wasn't really fun. I'm just waiting for it to come out on PC. Dear Lord, please, I beg it thee. You beg it? You beg it me? I beg it, I beg it the Lord. Whoever is the Lord. For Persona to come. Me. I've <laughs> always, Persona 5. always wanted to play Persona 5. Uh, it was released like so long ago now, and I've always wanted to play it. They're gonna release it. Because they released Persona 4, right? They're eventually going to release uh, it at some point. The fact and that I'm, they I'm done with this. The fact I'm that not, they I'm don't. How anymore. do they not put that on the Switch? Blows my mind. They put fucking Persona Five Strikers, which is the same story. I'm gonna be honest. Don't play it. Do not play no, it. No, I'm not. I'm waiting played. for the good stuff. Yeah, don't play it until you've played. It's not bad. It's a it's a pretty fun game, but. Don't play Persona 5 Strikers until you've played the main game, because it's literally the same story again. Just in a different combat style, basically. I figure eventually we'll get Persona 5 on the Switch. Yeah, we will eventually. Or, Switch or and I, PC Or I eventually. guess PC, yeah. The worst comes to PC worse. would be nice, because then you can get like full high frames, maybe even like a graphics upgrade. Please, do you Meh. want? Who, <laughs> needs, who needs good frame rate? <laughs> <laughs> Please, I want to play it on 140 FPS or 60. It's a 30 FPS. 60. Game. <laughs> <laughs> just, please, just give me sixty frames, please. Just give me sixty frames. I oh my think. god! I, playing Shin Megami Tensei on the uh, Switch. 
Uh, it has to be like one of the most heartbreaking things ever because you play it and you're like, this game is beautiful, but the Switch's visuals look like crap. <laughs> yeah, that's why. That's why I wanted to come out on PC mainly. I want to experience Persona 5 in like a, like a really beautiful, you know? Yeah. Because my PC is beast enough to, you know, yeah, my, deal. Yeah, my PC could handle that. My PC could handle Minecraft with shaders. We're good. I can handle Persona. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Can, That's when you know you've made it. Yeah, when you can play Minecraft with the shaders on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have another question for you then. Okay, uh, okay. Favorite mod on, on Minecraft? I don't play modded. You don't play modded? Oh my lord. No. <gasps> oh, <Bane. laughs> no, I'm a vanilla. Physical. I'm a vanilla Why? Minecrafter. I don't know. Why? I just love Minecraft. There's so many good mods. I love like it. Like Pixelmon. I love it the way it is. Pixelmon though. Who needs it? <laughs> or the vape mod. <laughs> you can vape. Why would I need that? <laughs> I love Minecraft. I love getting hyped for the releases and whatnot. And I I just play it vanilla. I always have. I've, I've played Minecraft since Tinker's it... Tinker's Construct is sick. I've played Minecraft since it was released. And I've never felt the need to go modded, I guess. Modded is fun, though. There's, like... I, I love the innovation mods. Like, like anything that, that gives you tech in there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Figuring out tech and how it works is always so fun for me. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop gushing about the tech mods. <laughs> yeah, when I was like, when I was in middle school, my friends were like, do you want to play Tech It? I'm like, what the hell is Tech It? Like, what is that? And I, I would always just be like, unhappy. Palmcraft is sick too. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm looking at chat. I would never want to play modded and all my friends wanted to play modded. Modded you should, Skyblock? You give it a try. Really what I go for. Give it a try. Should, I have! It try. It's not like I haven't tried it. It's just that I'm not a fan Last of month? it. Huh. I don't know why. Wild. I, I don't know why either. There's I like think so it's, much... I think there's something like comfortingly familiar about vanilla Minecraft. <laughs> I see. I, li I like... Like, the thing is, I get really bored of normal Minecraft really quickly. That's my issue. I need... Like... I need something co to constantly chase, or I get bored really fast. Right. Um, so, what ends up happening is that I, I, as soon as I start playing vanilla for like 10 minutes, I'm like, okay, I need a mod. <laughs> what? That's like absolutely not how I play. That's insane. Yeah, it's up. It, I, I'm very... I always feel like, oh my god, like there's so much I have to do in Minecraft, and I, I need to do all these builds that I have planned and whatnot. It's like my coping skill. I build factories that automate the creation of factories that help me make factories to convert the whole world into... <laughs> no, man. <laughs> Yeah, no, I, I like doing that too. I get, I get it. I get the, I get that too. Automating shit is so f Okay, I, we're, we're gonna stop. She doesn't know. We're I have no stop. idea what Thumbcraft is, guys. I just dig holes and binge podcasts. <laughs> That's, That's kind of what I do too, Insomnia. Yeah, I play vanilla and I listen to like uh, YouTube videos and podcasts and stuff. I binge podcasts when I play uh, um, roguelikes. Also, when I'm doing homework, also listen to podcasts. Do you play roguelikes? Hold on, that's a question. Uh, what would you... Give me an example of one. Hades, for instance. Yeah, roguelike. that's the only one that I play. <laughs> 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 that's where my knowledge ends. You should, I you love should, Hades. You should try other roguelikes. I love of Hades. Course, of course, it, it won't have the same story, like, feel. No other uh, roguelike does stories even close to how Hades does it. Okay, I'm just gonna be honest with you right now. Hades right? is so sexy. I love that game. But there are a lot of really good roguelikes. I love ro roguelikes a lot. I've played four on stream so far, and I, I'm not going to be stopping. I'm gonna be playing a lot more roguelikes on stream. I never thought that I would like the genre, and then when Hades came out, I was like, Ooh, that art style is like so banger. So I bought it impulsively because the art. I thought the art was yeah, good. I do that too. I, I do that too. And I got addicted to it. I got so hooked on it. If you like the whole like dying and looping gameplay aspect, um, I did like that different. a lot. Yeah. Then then you'll like other roguelikes too. There are um, one of the ones I'm playing right now, which is like one of the harder roguelikes, is called uh, Dead Cells, which is really fun. I've, oh yeah, I've, I've done heard like of that. five streams on it. Yeah. I, I've brought five, three, three, two, two streams right now. 
Maybe I'm gonna do more. But... Is, is Binding of Isaac one of those games? Yeah, it's a roguelike. Okay. It's a roguelike. Role, so yeah. I think that it's would one probably, of the. That's probably one of the ones that I would try. Yeah, you can try it. It's, it's more luck based. That one is very luck based. You gotta pray to the dear Lord <laughs> that you get the items you want. My friends play that one, so I, that's probably my next one. But if I, you wanna I don't play a roguelike with a friend. Um, there's one nah, called... Nah, 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 nah. Who needs friends? What? I don't know. Like, th there are some ones that are really good. Like Diablo um, or something? No, like, it, I don't know. It, it's like, there's one that's a two-player one that's really fun. Then there's one that's like a four-player one that I mainly play. You can play that solo and it's still very fun, solo. But the other one is mainly like, you want to play with others? Hold on, I'm trying to burp out this fucking goddamn <laughs> food. Goddamn, holy shit. Okay. <laughs> Uh, hold on, I'll tell you. Uh, Risk of Rain 2 oh, yeah. is yeah. is really fun with friends and or alone. Both I've had really, like, a lot of fun playing. Um, then there's one that I, I forgot. It's like, I think you'd like the art style. What is it called, chat, do you know? Like, it's like, uh, it's like a 3D, not 3D, oh, god damn it. It's like a first-person shooter game, but, like, with items... There's like multiple characters. It's a roguelike. Diablo. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 Diablo is it first person? It's not. No, it's isometric. Oh, it, I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Diablo fan as well. So. Control? No, 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 not control. That's not. That's not a roguelike. What the hell? What's that other one where the guys like killing shit? Doom. Is that a roguelike? <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? A roguelike? <laughs> You guys are wilding. Favorite <laughs> mangaka? Oh my gosh, Kentaro Miura, Favorite obviously. Mangaka. Miura, who does Berserk. The he... Problem is, I may or may not, may or may not have one. He's not only my favorite mangaka; he's also my favorite artist of all time, for sure. It's okay if you uh, don't have one. Not everyone reads person. manga. Person. Like I have a favorite artist that I that I. Uh, copy the shit out of <laughs> that's normal of, every day of my life okay there's a few one you might like just because of the art style alone is called what is this void bastards the uh, the, void the comedy bastards. aspect is very fun as well yeah the comedy is very fun as well but if you look up like just 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 look it up real quick uh, the art style you you'll, you'll I think you'll like the art alone looks 2d but is 3d void bastards let's look at some images oh oh this looks sick See? yes right? i told you oh look at these uh, character designs look so much fun too i'm trying to find the one that my brain is thinking <laughs> of yeah this looks hype yeah it, it's really fun i've played it a bit at like a friend's house what is this yeah one? i should really play more roguelikes because I loved, I loved Hades. As I said, if you won't get the same like story feel. That's sadly. okay. I love the grind of Hades, though. Like I yeah. love running and dying then and then doing like it again. Are, <laughs> then there's a few that are just weird. Cultist Simulator is what? really weird. Yeah, it is a really weird rogue. Like it's so like annoying to play sometimes. It's really hard. I have never beaten it ever. I've played a, a, a while of it. Have you beaten um, Hades? <laughs> yeah, I've beaten Hades a few times. Not enough to finish the story. I want to get really? back to it. Oh, oh it's man. Gunfire Reborn. There we go. Found it. Let's Finally. Look it up. Gunfire Born. That's a really fun one that people will like a lot. Oh, look at this art. Yeah. Oh, is that a kitty? What? Yeah, I told you. I I, I thought you'd like oh, it. Oh, it's a look at the dog. You can also look up Darkest Dungeon. Um, that's a uh, very great. Oh, that one I've seen. Okay. That one I have to play for right? sure. Yeah, this is like, so cute. I, I, I'm so in love with a lot of um, roguelikes. Do you like card games? I do like I do like card games, but I don't play that many. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. There's a roguelike. That's a card game. The it's one... called Slay the Spire. I know that. I think I know that one. Yeah, I think that's on it's my wish also... list. Really good, like uh, art style wise. I now this has just become a gaming podcast. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> We're allowed to talk about YouTube. anything that we want. 
<laughs> Sorry. But I don't I don't I don't limit us to conversations. I just have to I just have to apologize to YouTube. To before. YouTube? Oh to the YouTube, to YouTube people. Well Yeah. YouTube people They're here like, being like, Oh, I'm gonna hear this new guy talk about art and uh, apostro uh, apostrophe talk about art. Nah. <laughs> nah. To be fair, not many occasions have I actually talked about art on the podcast. <laughs> Oh, they're they're already ready. They a lot already of it, know. a lot of it is like just talking about things that we like and interests and get like just talking about li- our lives and such. So I think Did we're on the right track. Did you used to play? Um, uh, what was it? What was the game called? Ah, hold on, I'm gonna fucking find my epic games real quick. Dicey dungeons. Oh. <laughs> Dicey dungeons. Dicey dungeons. <laughs> it's supp- supposedly good. To had a friend play it a lot. Is it up? Dio a darkest. <laughs> oh, sorry. I think that's what he meant. Darkest. I, Dicey. Darkest, Dicey. <laughs> I was like so confused. Favorite book series. Mm. Um, also something that I uh, I don't I don't read. I, I, don't, I don't. I read. started reading again this year, but I haven't read any like series yet. I, mm. however, I've just started reading Earthsea from Ursula K. Le Guin. I'm enjoying it. Otherwise, I'd have to say Lord of the Rings is probably my favorite. Dead by Daylight is what I wanted to ask. You played Dead by Daylight. (laughs) Yeah, I've played a lot of Dead by Daylight. Yeah, that's the one. I remember you streamed it. That's the one thing we used to stream that wasn't art for a while. Yeah, I remember. I remember. I was like, ah, yeah. It was like Dead by Daylight came up on uh, Epic Store for free, and I was like, who do I play this with? I know I want to play it. (laughs) Me. Do I have? I, yeah, I guess I'll we play could do it. that at some point. Yeah, but I've been wanting to play it for a while. We could absolutely play it. It's fun. I love it. I have not I've played heard it. I've it's a lot of fun. I have not played it in forever. Don't have many people. Yeah. Like, I'm, I've been trying to get my friends, quite a few of them. Hey, yo, I know you claimed it by daylight, so what do you like to... Nope. <laughs> All right. No, I guess I guess I'll just go fuck myself. God damn. I've definitely fallen out of love with Dead by Daylight because of some of the things in that game. Specifically mm. like the monetization just kind of annoys me after a while. Yeah. But just yeah. just usually games die by that. Yeah, but just playing it like for fun, it's still really fun. Yeah, I, I just I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go co- competitive Apex mode or no. Valorant mode on it, you know. There are there is competitive Dead by Daylight, obviously. I'm not but. I am not surprised at all. I was I had a pretty solid rank for a while in Dead by Daylight. And Ooh, then we, I'm gonna be playing with a Dead by Daylight pro guys. I'll let you know how that retired goes. pro. <laughs> retired, sorry, retired pro. The yeah, skill I, will come back, don't worry. I have people that will play with me as well, so we could uh we could group I can up. queue up quite a bit. Yeah. yeah. All right. I'm done. I'm done. It's been a while since I've last like since I've even like I I opened the game for once like opened it and I was like, who do I play with? <laughs> and then I was like, I don't have anyone. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna close. No, nah, no. Nah, I okay. Yeah, I do understand. I never really played it alone. I guess that's also a thing. Is like. If I my... don't like playing games like that alone. Yeah, if my friend Esther is not around to play with me, I'm probably not playing it. <laughs> yeah. Or someone else. Makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense. Like, the only games I can queue solo are fighting games. Play a lot of fighting games. I don't- I mostly don't play anything online. Mm. Yeah, no, that makes sense, you know. The online experience sometimes, you know. Competitive can be wearing on the soul. I, I don't even play that many video games to begin with. <laughs> when I'm in when I'm in school, I don't really do much of that. Makes sense. Makes I sense. do focusing I, on the on the work is better. I just like playing games a lot. You know, I don't know. It's it's something that uh, I need to do, or yeah. I get really frustrated with everything else. Yes, I understand. For me, so. it's like when I get out of class and I'm just and I've got all my homework done. The, art, the fact that I have to move my fingers to play video games is like, that's too much for me right now. <laughs> I, I get that. Yeah, I get that, though. I'm like, I don't want to have to move my fingers around. <laughs> so yeah, I, get that. I usually just watch YouTube or something and take a lot of naps or I work out or whatever. Mm. That's about it. I don't think I could nap. 
No. My, my, like, the, the problem with me is like when I when I sleep, other than like when I'm going to sleep, I feel like like I'm missing out. <laughs> I don't know why. It, it feels weird. Oh my I can't God. explain it. I feel like I'm missing out on something. I'll be honest, I don't do anything of note during this time that I'm, I'm go I would have napped, okay? I, I either watch YouTube or I, I do nothing, basically. That's not me, man. <laughs> but I go, I have to do something other than sleep. No. That's why I stay up till 6 a.m. or pass, or when I pass out as well. You have FOMO on life. <laughs> God like, forbid. I'm, like, I'm missing out. I'm missing out on something. No way. I I like if I don't have a scheduled nap time during my during the day, I might get like frustrated. I'll be like, man, I can't. T I have no time for a nap today. Like this sucks. <laughs> what am I gonna? What am I gonna? What am I supposed to do? I can't take a nap. <laughs> I need a nap. Like, I took a nap right before this. Took a quick hour, <laughs> hour nap. Mm. Yeah, no, I don't, I can't handle an hour nap. That, I love that. That pisses me off. That's my favorite, my favorite hobby is probably taking a nap. <laughs> no, an hour nap would legitimately anger me. No, oh, no joke. No way. <laughs> it's, it's like an hour nap feels like I'm like, I'm like stopping myself from an actual sleep. Really? For me, yeah. if it's if it's under an hour, I'm like it's not enough. <laughs> I see. For me, it's like it has to be longer than like two to three hours at least, or I can. I wake up even more tired than I was. That's so funny. When I, no, I wake up when feeling. I, at first, I feel like eh, and then I get up and moving, and I'm like, okay, I'm ready for the rest of the day. Like, let's go. I I can't. I, it would legitimately anger me. No shot. <laughs> Been playing I'd Stardew be like, Valley oh. with a friend recently, a really chill farming game. It's the most fun I've had playing games with someone in ages. Yes. I love Stardew, Stardew Valley. Valley. is definitely nice to play. Oh my god, that game is amazing. It's so good. I, st I, I stopped playing it, like, now, but, like, uh, a month or two ago, I was playing it. It is fun. It is fun. It is so delightful. Uh, I bought it twice. That's how delightful it is. <laughs> Because I have it on PC and on the Switch. <laughs> you know, I'm not all that surprised. I, and you seem like the type of person who would really like buy Stardew Valley something twice. like that. Yeah. <laughs> I, farming sims are like a, weak, a weakness for me. Like Animal Crossing? Oh my god. I can't. Mm, I have, not, I, as I said, I'm not surprised. I have way I'm, too many I'm hours a, in Animal Crossing. I'm straight up more of a fighting game uh, player. Yeah, like, out, of, out of all the games I play, I think I have the most amount of time played on, like, fighting games. If I don't count Destiny for, like, a moment. <laughs> I'm not counting Destiny. That is a part of my life that I don't want to remember. Oh, no. <laughs> I spent 2,000 hours on it. I understand. My brother was a big Destiny player, and he yeah. would play all day, every day. And it was just... I played 12 hours a day every day for like two years. He was, he probably was up there with you. He probably like did the, the Lich King or whatever with you or whatever. The Lich King, that's World of Warcraft. <laughs> the Lich King. <laughs> whatever the other, whatever the lady is. I know, the I know. Evil, the evil lady. I just remember watching him play because like there was one TV in the, in the house that we would like share and just watching him play I and be play like- I didn't play Destiny 2, let me be clear. I played Destiny Oh, one. really? He played both. The original. He played- yeah, I, I, I stopped myself in the second one. I was wow. like, no, I'm not getting into it. When this. the second one came out, my brother was like, let's go. <laughs> yeah, I, I, a lot of Destiny fans are like that. I, the thing is, as I was quitting out of Destiny, it was still Destiny 1, and I was quitting out and starting to play Overwatch, that took my time for a while, but it, 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 it didn't even take close to how much... The Lich um, Queen. Oh, sorry. She's Lich a queen. queen. Different from World of Warcraft. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but uh, I, I got out around the second to last Valentine's Day event. Because I was, uh, the Valentine's Day event really made me feel something. I swear to God, like I felt, I felt like I woke up to reality or something. What? What happened? <laughs> I, I don't know. I was like, "Hey, yo, is what the, am I doing?" Is with the my romance? Life? Is the romance in Destiny? <laughs> like, I was like, crazy? It's, "It's it's Valentine's Day, and I'm sitting here, twelve hours playing goddamn Destiny, carrying people through the Valentine's Day event. What am I doing with my life right now?" <laughs> 
and I, that woke me up to something. I was like, no, I can't. I can't do this anymore, yeah. man. I've never, okay, I was about to say I've never truly been addicted to a video game. That is a total lie, and I should not even begin to utter that sentence. <laughs> what, what would you get addicted uh, to? Oh, uh, I can't, I can't. <laughs> it's it like, sounds like it is something This is bad. like very cringe. Like, okay. very, very cringe. I'm very cringe. All right. Um, when I was in middle school and I got a laptop for the first time and I had like no social life, right? Okay. And I would play Feral Heart. I don't know if you know Feral Heart. I don't know if I anyone do knows know Feral what, Heart. I do not know what this game is. Good. I would play Feral Heart all day long. Also Minecraft. But I would like switch between the two all day. And that was like where my social life was in middle school. It was like I would just come home from school and sit and play feral heart for like all like so many hours just talking to people online about nothing <laughs> no i that was truly addiction i think and minecraft too it's not the good. thing is right i was so addicted in, in destiny that is I feral heart that myself. furry mmo yes <laughs> <laughs> But they're not upright. They're uh, they're on four legs, so it doesn't count as a furry MMO. Okay, they're they're <laughs> they're feral. Get it? <laughs> oh, I see. That makes sense. <laughs> but uh, I played Destiny so hardcore that you know how there's like weeklies, right? That you do. Yes. Like there's I've like played. weekly. Sh yeah, you you'd have to do like weekly shit, right? So I do the weeklies on my like all all three of my characters. Then what I do. Is I'd help other people do them for the rest of the week, every day. Mm. Multiple people a day. That's that's like whenever my fi whenever I play Final Fantasy and uh, online the MMO and my guild leader Life is later. my guild leader is always like helping everyone with all their stuff. I'm like, dude, you literally play this game all day. Like, how do you? How is this a thing? And I. I'm very grateful for him, but I, oh, I also am like, this is worrisome sometimes, I think. <laughs> Not definitely. In the back of yeah, my I, head. <laughs> but no, that, that Valentine's Day event definitely, like, changed my brain somewhere. <laughs> I was like, never again. I'm it wasn't like, it wasn't again. like Christmas or anything, or... It was Valentine's. It was Valentine's Day. I think the love in the air really, like... <laughs> <laughs> made me feel a sort of way. I was like, oh, all forever. these couples that I'm destroying right now. Forever alone. Because it was, because it was, okay, the event was, you had to play duos, okay, and and it was just like uh, competitive. You just had to play duos ranked, basically, that's it, right? And I was just sitting there playing duos, got to the max like rank there, and I was like, what? am I doing <laughs> my life I'm carrying people to the max rank and I'm, I'm destroying all these couples in front of me because they they can't they they don't know how to shoot it can't be anything else it can't be I was like okay no you know what I can't anymore I'm, I'm done I'm quitting that's never again it's amazing <laughs> and, I, and then I stopped that's legitimately the last day I played destiny one I was like never again am I coming back to this game Tufel said he spent a lot of time in Minecraft. I, I Dude, did too. I, I well, spent when I was younger. so much time. But the good thing about Minecraft is that when I was online playing, I was playing with my classmates. So, like, those relationships... I played solo. Yeah, those relationships and friendships would translate into real life rather than, like, when I was playing Feral Heart and it's just a bunch of strangers from the internet. <laughs> it's so sad. It's a little bit better. So... <laughs> I don't count myself as though. truly lost in the Minecraft sauce because I was playing with classmates. <laughs> <laughs> lost in the Minecraft sauce. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I get it. Though. Oh my god. Oh, but to, to continue the where the conversation was, I was gonna say after, is if I don't count Destiny in my highest list of uh, played games. Uh, it's Dragon Ball Fighters. No way! <laughs> that I've played the most. I that's... have 520 hours on that game. Okay, that's about how much and I have. It's a fighting in... game. That's like how much I have in Animal Crossing. Yeah, you know, I, I've played a lot of that game. I ha I would have had more time played on the game, but Asia servers don't have any players playing. 
so I'm kind of forced not to play it a lot of the times. I have to fight people that are in in America, so I have to play it at, at exclusively at oh. night. And that's when I stream. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so I can't play it most of the time. It's it's so, uh it's preventing your addiction. It is, it is. It's it it, it, it put it to a stop. I like how there's two cats on the screen. Yeah, no. well I figured I looked it. away for a moment and then I look back and I see two cats. I figured we needed another one. <laughs> Makes sense. Time zones are awful. They are the worst. They are. They are. We should just all be on the same time all the time. <laughs> be such a mess. The Earth should be flat. The Earth. Should... Can we change it? Is it too late? <laughs> hey, the flat Earth, flat, flat Earthers are gonna disagree with you on that. Is it too late to make it flat? Yeah, they're like, it's already yeah, flat. Gonna... What do you mean? Yeah, it, it's already flat, bro. What are you, what are you talking about? <laughs> I don't know how many hours I've spent in the in the games that I've played for the longest amount of time. Like Minecraft doesn't track Team your Fortress. hours. Jesus. Team Fortress 2 though. That's funny. That's a lot. Minecraft That's does not lot. track your hours, neither does Feral Heart, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> You're a different kind of flat earther then? <laughs> That's I, a good question. Yeah, I want the Earth to be flat. I don't believe that it's flat now, but I think that that should be a goal of <laughs> ours as a species. <laughs> to flatten it out. I'm pro flat Earth, but not in like the not in like oh it's flat right now. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I like how you said Apostro that we should go for uh, a one hour and <laughs> now. Oh my bad. Now, I know, yeah, I know, I, I see the timer, hours. it's okay. Yeah. You're not the first yeah, it's person- It's gonna go for way longer, don't worry. You're not the first person that's been on it for two hours, you're good. The problem is, I can talk for like, very long. Eventually, my, uh, eventually we'll have to, we'll have to stop because I'll have to get yep. food. You'll have to get food, yep. Because the that's cafeteria, the, the, the cafeteria will close downstairs and I'll be hungry. So, well, at some close point. And, and how long? <laughs> It closes at nine, so in two hours. <laughs> but I I'd can like... go for two hours more. <laughs> funnily enough, funnily enough, I don't. I can go. I don't think I don't. I don't. I don't like going at nine to the cafeteria though, because then Makes all the sense. all the food is like just uh, kind like of like old and yeah. not. Yeah. No, I get it. We'll stop like, earlier than that, yeah. but I can go for two hours. Is what I'm saying. <laughs> the, the 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 thing is. I'm a very talkative person. I don't know. I don't know why. Hey, uh, we're both streamers. I understand. <laughs> true. True. It's it's a pro. It's an addiction. Yeah, I'm also very talkative. <laughs> when when I start talking, I can't stop. I feel. I that's why I stream is because I I need someone to talk to all day long. <laughs> I, I, agree. I agree. Otherwise, I go bananas. And I don't have I don't have a roommate in college. I I have too many friends. This is a problem. It, it's it's not a problem, but it it means that I can continuously talk. So like what ends up happening in my day, a posture, okay, I wake up, start playing a game, and that friend goes, right? Then I instantly get into a call with another friend, play <laughs> games. Then that friend goes, then I <laughs> then I talk to another friend, play games. And then it just keeps going. Until you're I just, pass out. You're just being social. There's nothing wrong. <laughs> the problem is then I then I then I stop like talking for an hour, right? And I'm there like, damn, why don't I get this more often? I feel really relaxed right now. <laughs> Forgetting. My brain is just... finally rested. Yeah. <laughs> it's so weird. No, I talk. In the morning, I like to see how long I could go before I start monologuing to myself. And it's, uh, it's, uh, I can't go very long. So the, I talk, yeah, I talk to myself a lot. I'm very, uh, like, that's how I work no, out. That's how I cope with life, is by talking <laughs> to myself. That's how I make my plans. Like, when I wake up in the morning, I, I start talking to myself, and I'm like, okay, today I'm going to do this, and then I have backseat drawing at five, and then after that I'm going to get dinner. So I start chatting with myself, and that's just how my day goes. <laughs> That's a great way to. That's a great way to start the day. Honestly, it's never quiet in my. It's never <laughs> quiet. <laughs> the the thing is, right? 
I I'm enjoying this this stream right now only because I don't have to do anything like draw. <laughs> I've done this and I just I just stopped and I'm I'm just vaping and I'm chatting. That's great. <laughs> you could draw. Yeah, I'm, I'm really I'm really chill right now. You could draw if you want, but you I, yeah, don't have I know, to. Yeah, I know. I know. I was here like, oh yeah, you know, I did, I did, I did a, I did a kind of painting doodle. The last, uh, the last guest I had on the podcast was Wildberry, mm -hmm. and he has like no idea how to draw. <laughs> He's a writer, <laughs> ah. and it was, it was, he was uh, so lost. It was so funny. <laughs> so that's totally okay if you don't want to draw. He not being lazy. Nothing new, okay? Hey, Amen. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like uh, three streams ago. What I did for the whole stream is I drew, like, not even a sketch, okay, half of a sketch, okay? Then I started talking, and I, I didn't stop. I didn't go back to the drawing. I just talked for two hours. Then I'm like, oh, guys, I'm so sorry. I haven't drawn anything. Let me quickly I've just been this sitting up. here podcasting this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> then I sketched because everyone else was engaging with me, okay? So I couldn't not... Oh, I feel like if they're and then I quickly if they're chatting you up, it's fine though. You yeah, know? it is. It is. Then I then I quickly finish the sketch. Then I think I rated you or something. And then I then I was like, all right, guys. And then I, I was probably like, what did you draw today? And you were like, nothing. Yeah, and then I was like, ah, uh, <laughs> nothing. Damn, uh, I drew this, <laughs> which was like a week ago. But I said I drew this. <laughs> I do that a lot, though. I, I, I'm just like, yeah, I drew this. I did not That's draw okay. that. That's okay. I do though. that, too. Like, if I rate certain artists and they're like, let me see what you've been drawing. I send them, like, the best thing I've drawn this week rather than what I was just drawing, like, two seconds ago. Sometimes it's trash. And I'm like, this is what that I've been working said, on. <laughs> one of my recent pieces that I'm doing. That sounds like I said Reese's pieces. Reese's I said pieces. recent. Yeah. <laughs> recent pieces that I'm drawing. Mm, Reese's. Is really, really nice. I'll give you a... I don't think... I think I shared this, maybe. I'm gonna send you Is this one with, the, on with the legs? Yeah, it's the one with the legs. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not, not the one with the legs. No, 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 no. No? I remember, because this is the one that I drew legs in, which is rare for me. You drew legs in it? Yeah, it has legs. Yeah. Look at it. Hang on. Let's see. Discord? Looks so good. Oh, yeah. Oh, this? Oh, I didn't yeah. see this. I was talking about the lady with the legs. Yeah, this I know. I know sick. the lady. Yeah, I know the lady. I'm trying to this properly get it on, I've been on screen. This looks great. Like, I, I'm so proud of the sketch that I, I want to finish it. It's a Dead, dead Cells X Enan art. Yeah, so. you should finish this. The like the perspective on the leg, the the right leg is really nice too. The one that's going yeah. back. Yeah, I'm yeah. really happy with this. Yeah. I'm really happy with this. I'm, I'm I'm gonna finish it soon. I've been saying that for a week, but <laughs> <laughs> shit. I have an art project that I'm trying to get done right now, but I haven't even started it. I understand. It's just how it is, right? You just start <sighs> yeah. procrastinating on other things or something. Like I, I still haven't finished the legs drawing, the one, the original, <laughs> the the really nice. Um, how do I say this without like sounding weird? Chat. Oh God. Oh Dan's here. Hi Dan. <laughs> you know the one I'm talking about, right? The the baseball girl. Yeah, the baseball. That's the one yeah. I'm talking about with the legs. Yeah, yeah that's the one I was um, like. I still haven't finished that. <laughs> by the way, it's not done yet. I like that drawing a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna finish it. I think uh, that's like one of my best. Uh, it sounds so weird. Only artists will understand that this is not like I'm not trying to be weird. Uh, it's my best like legs in a piece. Go. <laughs> I understand like that. I it. understand that, man. <laughs> it's so weird, like trying to like explain it. This is my best like, drawing of legs. Yeah, it's like how are you gonna like what? And when I saw it, I was like, these legs look great. I think I said that on yeah. stream. I was like, not to sound yeah. weird or anything. Yeah, exactly. You gotta preface it, right? But these it's legs like... look pretty good. <laughs> uh, I bought a new vape juice today. That is fun. You bought um, a new I, vape I, juice. Do yeah. you vape? I was like, do you, yeah, I what, vape. What do you vape, though? Uh, what? Wait. Because it's like, like, do you mean like, like nicotine, nicotine or like, or like weed? Nicotine. I'm okay, not a, I'm, okay. I, I, I panic really hard with uh, with weed. All right. Yeah, fair enough. Fair I have enough. panic attacks. I don't know why. It's like some genetic bullshit or something. Yeah, I think I'm immune to weed, which is okay. <laughs> uh, so the thing is, until you do it like four or five times, you're going to be immune 
quotes. I've definitely done it more than that. Is that legal? I've done it oh, weed twice. is weed? Yeah, it, it is. It is. It is. Weed is legal in New Jersey. I am allowed to say that. It's not just that. You can say it on <laughs> on stream because a lot of people smoke weed on on stream. Right. Well, so, just so you all know, fine. it's legal in New Jersey. I'm of age. <laughs> I'll have you all know. I did it quite a bit. I'll, I'll be honest, when I was growing up, uh, and I would not recommend, I don't, I'm not a fan. Twofolds, it's illegal but, uh, where you are? Are you for real? In Sweden? Yeah, yeah. I'm not all that surprised. Why is it? So, I feel like y'all so have like, everything, like, so nice. That's it's, why, right? It's illegal? That's why. What? That's so weird. But, uh, like, I, I started smoking when I was pretty young, so pretty young fucking 17 like so cigarettes or like weed cigarettes cigarettes straight oh, wow. up like cigarettes i started smoking weed when i was like 17 too but that's like we don't talk about that <laughs> but um right after i started funnily enough i smoked weed before i smoked cigarettes i i've never weed for a while. same but i've never smoked a cigarette though <laughs> yeah because it, like i don't need to touch that, that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't recommend anyone touch, touches cigarettes or weed to begin with, honestly. N not worth, on uh, like, IMO. Um, weed less so than cigarettes. Cigarettes is worse, uh, like, addiction-wise. Because um, you can get really addicted to cigarettes, whereas weed you can get rid of pretty easily, in my opinion. You can, you can get off weed pretty easily. Um, but what I was saying, though, is I started smoking, like, a little bit after I started uh, smoking weed, and then I smoked for like three years straight, cigarettes. And then, like last year, I was like, "This needs to stop." Wow. I need to. I need to sm stop smoking cigarettes specifically. It's killing me really badly. Like I started feeling really shit. Like my lungs and every I started feeling really. Yeah, man, bad. that stuff is not good for you. <laughs> Yeah, Obviously. so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna swap to smoking, uh, not smoking vaping. And I'm gonna tell you right now, holy shit, I feel so much better. Man. Yeah, vaping so does wonders, except for all the kids that are vaping nicotine when they did not have an addiction to cigarettes prior. Yeah, that's, that's what, like, I don't get. It's so you know? crazy because uh, there was a point where, like, everyone in my generation, and pro your generation too, I guess, like no one smoked cigarettes there was yeah. no there was no nicotine issues there was no nicotine in issues. in our generation like that were and then the that bad the, the vape culture came yeah in. yeah and then the jeweling jeweling was invented they started targeting like those fun Younger. flavors and the young yep. people and now everyone once yep, again is addicted to nicotine it's insane yep. <laughs> yep. Yep. it's crazy i did it because i was uh I was, I was real depressed i was like you know what cigarettes are my only friend <laughs> and that's how I went into it. Sweden cracks down on on alcohol. Wow. Uh, that that I, oh, th this is why I can't leave, li live in Sweden. Wow. I'm a very no alcohol very... in Sweden. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I, I, I can't love go. alcohol so much. It's yeah, illegal. Like... The only company allowed to sell alcohol is state issued Monopoly. Doesn't sound that bad though. They're not allowed to advertise. Well, as long as you can still drink, it's fine. <laughs> yeah. You know, in my country, like drinking. It's completely illegal. It's illegal? Ab absolutely. What? Yeah. Really? So what I have to do is I have to like muggle it. What the <laughs> Yeah. What? Yeah. Like it's it's so weird. Like uh, oh I, I can tell this story I think on stream, yeah. Because like I I almost got mugged once, um trying to my my chat knows this, but uh, I almost got mugged once trying to get alcohol. <laughs> So, um, around like 10 p.m., uh, like two years ago, roughly, maybe three, yeah, three years ago, right before Corona, um, I went out to buy alcohol, right? And I, I had my friend, I gave him the money just in case like something happens so he can run. He's faster than me. <laughs> this what? is how much, this what is how much heck? you gotta prepare. Yeah, this is how much you gotta prepare. I also like uh, brought his bag along. So we can like put it in the bag, you know, all that. We're ready. So I went. Uh, he's like a like a like a college student. So um, 
we went and what what happened was uh, we went there and we got into the warehouse they don't sell it um, they don't sell it in bars like in normal countries or like standard shops there right. are specific warehouses that you have to know like you have to know of them that they sell it you have to go there and you gotta ask for it and then you gotta like you gotta pay the alcohol price then you gotta pay like um like extra like a little bit extra to the people there or you're or they're gonna rob you basically okay so we brought the money enough money to do all that and then we go in there um, we go in there and they go, yeah, I wouldn't recommend you guys buy today. And then we go, why? They go, yeah, there are people outside mugging uh, our customers and we can't do anything about it because it's illegal, right? Um, it's illegal yeah. for it right. to even be sold. So they can't really call up the cops and be like, hey, yo, <laughs> you know, they can't. So it's like, all right, I get it. So we just walk out instead. We don't buy anything. We just walk out. That's so and weird. What? Yeah, these guys are mugging people for alcohol. They don't want to buy. They don't have the money to buy, so they're just basically taking from the people that are buying. And they'll let you go if you just give them the alcohol, right? That's how they're doing it. So we got out. We don't have any alcohol on us. As we're walking, like, me and my friend, my, my friend looks back and he sees, like, three people. And he's like, Enan, people are, like, looking at you and then following. I'm like, yeah, I had a feeling. So, um... We keep walking and then uh, they just come up on us, all right? Like four, uh, like six people, I think, six or five, five people on the on the dot. Um, then uh, we go, uh, like he's like running and he starts running. I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna. I want to see what these guys want with me. So instead of running like a normal Dude. human being, <laughs> oh God. like a normal human being, uh, um, I I go. I go, you know what, sure, I'll, I'll stand around. Uh, I stand around, and I, I just let them catch me. And my friend at this point ha has ran, I'm like, go, just go. You know, I, I, I wave at him to go, he's, he's gone at this point, he's calling up his friends, like, making sure, like, he can rescue me. He's, he's, like, already figuring out, like, a rescue plan. While I'm just standing there, and these guys are like, you got the alcohol? I'm here like, huh? And then I go, no. We didn't buy any. We didn't have the money. Then he went, what do you mean? He pu he pulls out the... He pulls out my wallet, checks and sees like one dollar in there. Oh. He goes, one dollar? Puts the wallet back without even taking the one dollar. He's like... <laughs> I'm like, alright, you know what? These, these, these robbers have class. He, pit, he, pitied, he pitied you, bro. <laughs> he pitied me. He's like, what? <laughs> and then he, then he, then he took my bag, opened it, and checked for something. They, they were like, they're rummaging through it, and they're like, found something. We pulled it out and saw that it was a goddamn umbrella. And it, then they put it back as well. Then they looked through the books and like, oh, you're this guy. I named my friend, and I'm like, yeah, I am this guy. <laughs> And he's like, oh, you go to this college. I'm like, yeah, exactly where I go. I study there. Mm -hmm. Definitely in, in a college. You know? And then they make me sit down and they start lecturing me about, like, how bad my friend is for leaving me. And I'm here like, what the fuck? Oh, they're lecturing you about how bad your friend is? Wow. Yeah, while robbing me. <laughs> yeah, wow. And I'm here like, huh. Then I go, it's... It's not up to you to decide who I'm friends with, you know? They, then they're like, you know what, you should get better friends, I'm here. Like, yeah, cool, good to know. You nice. should get better friends? <laughs> what? Yeah. I don't, don't add. These people are like, legitimately made me feel like, what? But then, this is the, this is the funny part, right? This is like, haha, funny. Then they go, we're gonna make you drink alcohol? Then we're gonna call up your dad. I'm here like, in my brain, I'm like, my dad already knows I drink though. Hmm. All right. And I'm like, yeah, sure, do it. My dad knows I drink. And they're like, oh, then we're gonna call the police. I'm like, hmm, they're gonna call the police. Uh, and then I go, you know, I know the police, right? I know a lot of people in there. You're not gonna get me with any of these charges, right? 
alcohol is such a non-issue for me that you aren't gonna get me with that. You know? So why why don't you like? Maybe you're gonna you're gonna be in more trouble. Hmm. <laughs> then because they had nothing else to say to me, they're like, you know what? Just go. <laughs> so they. What the so hell? They up, so they end up letting me go. What the? That's such a. Oh my god. Why is it illegal? <laughs> I don't know. That's... Either way. Dude. Either way. As I'm leaving, I have this like Bluetooth headset on me. As I'm leaving, they're like, no no parting gifts. I'm like, what? Bro, I, I literally have one dollar. What do you want from me? Then he goes, the headset. I'm like, Bro. oh, really? I, I, I bought this, like, in my mind, I bought this for ten dollars, okay? And... The b day before that, it was raining really heavily. Guess what I did? I ran around in the rain with that head headset on my head. Do they like zap you while now? While listening to music. No, it didn't zap me, but <laughs> it was it was very like it it kept coming in and out while I was trying to listen to the music afterwards. So I was like, "You want this broken headset? You know what? Sure. Here, take it." <laughs> Fully knowing that it's gonna break any moment. And then I walk. Oh, by the way, before before all this, they took out my phone as well. And I thought they were going to, like, take the phone or something, right? You know what they did? They looked at my phone and then put it back in my pocket. <laughs> and I was just confused. I was just confused at that point. I was like, do they want to rob me? Do they not? Are they just here to lecture me about my friendships? Are they just... Is that it? I just sound like they might be a little bit... A little bit dumb. <laughs> oh my god. And then I then I started walking, but I could feel that they were still following me. And then I got a I got a call from one of my friends being like, "Hey yo, where are you at? You you okay? I'm here." Like, "Yeah, bro, they just let me go." He's like, "What?" I'm like, "Yeah, I'll tell you the story like once I'm back." I'm like, "Okay." I mean, you're good, right? I'm like, "Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. There's like nothing here. I'm not I'm not even going to like I'm not joshing you, dude. Like they literally let me go." I'm like, "All right, cool." I cut the call. And then I <laughs> I could still feel them following me. As I'm walking, I see like a big ass crowd of people and I'm really skinny. Okay, I'm really <laughs> skinny. I weigh in like 39 kilograms, okay? I don't know, I am kilograms? Really... What do you think I am? <laughs> uh, I don't know the, the, the we're, American system. We're pound so. people here. <laughs> you, could probably, you could probably translate that into pounds. How many kilograms? 39. <laughs> what? No, you'd be dead. <laughs> I am. I am. The, I am literally thirty nine. No, you're not. I am. No way. Wait, is this mass? I, Why does it say I mass? I can I can measure it. I, no. I, I can. Get, I can. I can get. I can get a picture of, of the goddamn thing saying I'm thirty nine kilograms. All right. I am that. <laughs> the like, fuck's a kilogram? <laughs> kilogram. <laughs> the fuck is a kilogram? <laughs> That's really uh, funny. There's no uh, way you weigh 39 kilos. 85 pounds? No. Yep. Are Sounds you right. are yep. you sh are you short? He's like, yeah. Sounds about right. Yeah, I am. I'm very light. You're I'm you're honest. short. Nope, I'm not short. You're not I short? No I'm way. I'm five ten and a half. I'm not short. He's like 80 pounds soaking wet from the looks of him, dude. What? <laughs> yeah, sound about right. Yeah. You're small. I'm not. I'm not tiny. That's no. I'm, I'm, I. I. I am thin. I don't believe. But I'm not. You. I'm tall. Can you even be eighty pounds? How tall are you? <laughs> Five, ten and a half. What? Yeah. No. Uh, How? Yeah. No way, dude. I uh, am. Yeah. No. <laughs> this is a. This is a conversation. 80 pounds? Uh, Sorry, I changed yeah. the entire conversation. Dude, you gotta, uh, see, you gotta see a doctor for that shit. Hang I, on. I've, I've, checked, I've, I've checked in with what? the doctor many times. Many what? times. What? And every doctor has been like, you're fine. No, you're not. <laughs> I, they said I'm fine, so I'm fine. I think I weigh like, I weigh almost like double what you weigh. And I'm shorter than you. <laughs> a lot of people, a lot of people weigh double than me. No way. It's not hard to be double my weight. It's really not. I'm not double yet, but a couple more uh, bags of Cheetos and I might get there. <laughs> I don't know. 
but no, I'm very, I'm very skinny. That's so, insane. Um, so what, what, what brought this along? Oh yeah. You were talking so, about how skinny you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what happened was, I I'm so skinny that I can like basically slither through a goddamn crowd of people without any problems. Because I'm basically goddamn a paper sheet. <laughs> so I just whooshed right through. So but yeah, Tufels is also very skinny. Tufels is 130. If that's like, that's that's not skinny like you are. But yeah, Tufels also six three, dude. I didn't know you were that tall. He is that tall. Flat man, Stanley he's... over here, <laughs> man. I don't. I think I weigh like 145. That I'm five seven. <laughs> yeah, am I five but seven? But I, I slithered. I slithered through a crowd, right? Five seven is. It's not that bad of a height. It's pretty good. I might be five six and lying, but we'll see. I mean, it's five still six and a bad. half. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to my ranges now. <laughs> <laughs> It'll take the half an inch. I'll you take know? it. I'll take I'll it. I'll take any. I'll <laughs> take it. But um, I slithered through the crowd and I I walked out and they lost me through that crowd. And then I went up and met up with the friend who had my money. I was like, alright, good. My money was safe. I cared more about my money than my own life there. Oh my god. <laughs> I was down to see what they were gonna do. Why were you down? I would have been like, I no wanna, way. Listen, listen, I like experiences, okay? Uh, I like experiencing things. You're like, I'm scared to go to school in a different country. But these guys tried to mug me and I kind of just was like, messing with them. <laughs> <laughs> That is, that is kind of wild, huh? I think you'll be fine in, in another country going to school. The thing is, right, let, let's say let's say this this bullshit because my brain works like this. This is stupid, right? It's stupid to do that. What if I, I, I'm that stupid in the other country? What if, like, I do that, right? What if I just do that in another country and I get shot for it? What happens? What, where are you, in America? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Be careful, bro. <laughs> the guns are... There's a lot of guns here. <laughs> Not going to America. Oh my Unless, God. Unless cons. Cons sound fun. I want to go to a con. Yeah, you should come to one. I want to. I'm probably going to visit eventually America. The U.S. Was, visit. Um, the I US will not right. stay. That is... That sounds like a... Like a... Like a... Like a... Like a murder scene waiting to happen. The Asian man gets killed. Honestly, I, living here, like... <laughs> It's so strange because it just feels normal at this point. Like when, yeah. when we're when we were kids and stuff, we used to have like lockdown drills in the school for like active shooters and stuff. So growing up, we'd have to do active shooter drills, and like when you're really little, they don't tell you what it's actually for, and it's just like it's crazy. So it's just crazy. sort of normalized uh, in the U.S. Like. Gun yeah. violence, it's everywhere. Gun violence, yeah. Exactly why, as I said, I can't, I know I can't stay in the US for all that long, but I'm definitely willing to, like, you know, go to a con and, so, uh, and shit like that. That sounds fun. Yeah. Staying there, though, scary. Yeah, I don't like that. Yeah, I'm looking to get out of here. <laughs> I want to go to Germany. Not. That's like, uh, Germany's that's, that's pretty like cool. the end goal for me. Germany's pretty cool. It's so stupid why I want to go there, too. <laughs> Why do you want to go? Yeah. Is there a dumb reason? Do you just... It, 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 it's, really, it's really dumb, okay? Do you like Tufels, the language? Rokat, Tufels and Rokat know this very well, and oh, I'm about boy. to get into this again Hang on. for the 7,000th time. Okay. <laughs> you could tell me. It's all right. Is it it's cringe? Are you like... A, the women... <laughs> <laughs> I told you, it's, it's really dumb. <laughs> but it's the women. But like, You're going the women, to... <laughs> the women. Okay, listen, the women. All right. The women. The accents are amazing. All right, I can't. Can't. What? Can't not. That's so funny. <laughs> listen, all right. That's not a bad. That's not a bad reason to want to go to Germany, I guess. <laughs> There's so many clips of me saying that. If you, you think, don't even. If you think that the people are attractive, why not? That's the main reason I want to go. I'd say. I'd say. What time is the it? The country itself is great, but... Oh, man. The women I is think the reason. I think it's about that time, bro. Ah, it's about that time? It's about that time, and I have to go time. eat. 
gotcha, gotcha. This, this was long. This yeah. was like goddamn huge. Yeah, it was a long podcast one. right here. Oh, I'm gonna cut off the recording before I cut you off, though. So I'm gonna yeah. say we'll have to say goodbye to YouTube audience. Gotcha. YouTube audience. You say, you say your goodbye, then I'll I'll just squeal or something. YouTube audience. I'm gonna put links to Enan's Twitch stream in the in the description, and you guys should go and follow him, and cheer in his chat and sub to him <laughs> with Prime, of course. And I'll see I you guys all in whatever video comes next. <laughs> <laughs> I said I, I said I